Okay, so what the plan? Yeah. Well, your plan for the day was to we'll have a run at the, the turn of the road, mm -hmm. and you but you want to break it down into the little segments. I do. And then have a little chat about each bit at the at the That's end. That's right. Yeah. So well, the first bit is coming out from the test centre, getting the car in and setting the scene, if you like. Right. Then there's the drive to the location, then right. the brief, then the attempt. Right. So let's have a little look at the at the first bit. So he'll get you to get in the car. Okay. He'll have a look around the vehicle and make right. sure there's no dents and scratches that he's going to get blamed for. Whilst, whilst that's happening, I'm preparing my notes. If you've had a little sneaky look at the form and you know what it's going to be... Ah, uh, so I might know, not get the you opportunity. You might not know, but <gasps> when he hands you the form and says, uh, just sign this declaration and say that you're not exempt from seatbelts um, and that yeah, you're, you're insured. Yeah. Uh, as you're doing that, have a look at the form, it'll tell you what you're going to get. Oh God, I'm not very good at spotting things, reading things <laughs> quick, under pressure. <laughs> Right, I was like, I'll just I'll take this to the toilet with me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you won't get the chance to digest it in a lot of detail. <laughs> um, but if you haven't done that, and when, yeah. when you get to the car, he'll say to you, um, I'd like you to teach me, treat me as a pupil at the, the party train stage. Uh, my last instructor said he was going to do a lesson on uh, turn of the road today. He can't make it. Um, he's at the dentist. Um, he's got the same sort of car as this, so I'm familiar with the layout and controls of this vehicle. Take a couple of minutes to collect your thoughts. Over to you when you're ready. Right. Well, hello. Hiya. I'm Nicola. Oh, hi, Nicola. Hi. Call me Bob. Hi, Bob. Um, yeah, is that what, how you like to be called? Yeah, yeah, Bob's fine, yeah. Bob, all right. Um, so I believe your instructor's not here today? A dentist or something, I think. Something like that, yeah. Mm. Right, OK. Sooner him than me. Yeah. <laughs> right, so what are we expecting to do today? What are you expecting to do today? Uh, it was like the turn on the road, he said. Right, yeah, yeah, that's what he said to me. Mm. Right, okay, well, we can do that. Um, what What did you do on your last lesson? Have, have you done turning the road before? No, no, we've not done that. We're doing like sort of basic junctions. Right, okay, so you've not done any reverse park, any reversing whatsoever? No. So no. you're not taking the car backwards? No. All right, well, don't worry, we'll run with what? what we've got. Mm. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll have a go at it. Um, start rolling a minute. Okay. I forgot what you said we were doing, so we're having the introduction here. Mm -hmm. We're doing the brief where we're going. Yeah. So we're in the car park now, are we? We are. In the, right. So then I'm going to say to you, right, so um, we'll set off whenever you're ready. Okay. Is that that? So if there's any uncertainty, yeah. then just ask him. Right, so okay. Do you want the brief here? Do you want it where we're going? Right. He'll, he'll happily tell you. Right. He's not going to go, well, I'm not telling you because I told you earlier. Okay. <laughs> he'll just say, uh, oh, give me the brief when we get there. Okay. All right. Still in role, though, I'll say. Would you like your brief there? or No, because yeah. you, you as a student might not necessarily expect no, he'll a still, brief. No, he'll still tell you from right. within role. Okay. He, won't, he won't leave you struggling. He'll All just right. say, no, just give me the brief when we get there. Okay. Right. Wonderful. So I'm saying to you now, do you want the brief there? Um, yeah. Okay, then. So are you ready to... Uh, have you done your cockpit drill? Uh, no, no, not yet, no. Okay. You've driven this car before. I have. Similar so. I have, yeah. Right. So, um, nice and neatly. Okay, we just did your mirrors. Right. So, just a question. Mm -hmm. He's not necessarily. He's not. I'm not watching him do seatbelt or anything like that. He'll not play any tricks like that at this stage no. for this one. No. No. But do keep an eye on it, just in yes. case. Just in case. Just in do case. Do they sometimes throw it in there? No. Right. Uh, it'd be very unusual. But yeah. do but do keep an eye on it. It's Show them that you're watching him. Yes, yeah, good practice, isn't it? Okay. So I'm going to go left out of the car park. Okay, so we're going left out the car park. Rolled back very slightly then. Well, you took me by surprise, yeah. fella. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll keep an eye on observations and control. Right. The left at the end of the road. Okay, so we're going left. Sorry, you did tell me. Left at the end of the road. Get rid 
and turn left where the van came out of. Okay, so we're going to take a left where the van came out of. So you've just gone the wrong way around a one-way street. Uh, yeah! I don't believe it! He's and he's a copper! He should be a copper, shouldn't he? <laughs> A bit close up behind that. Right. That didn't you? I know that there's not really a great deal of room to move around this uh, bin bin truck, whatever you call it. All right. Um, but had you have stopped a bit sooner, you could have maybe looked at whether you could get around it. But you're too close All to right. manoeuvre around it now, aren't you? All right. Right at the end of the road. Okay, so we're going. Right. Slow down, slow down. Remember what I said, stop. Don't want to get too close behind this vehicle. Oh, right. Right. right, now just just hold back for a bit. Now, do you think you can get through that gap? Not sure. Well, you don't have to if you. It's quite a small gap, isn't it? It is, yeah. What should I do? Um, I'd wait. Hold back and wait. You're nearly at the end of the road, but it's going to make a decision in a bit. It's either going to go one way or the other. Oh, it right. might not go the way we're going. We'll go right at the end of the road. Go right at the end of the road. Yay. <laughs> oh. oh. Okay, follow that truck. <laughs> oh. Oh. Right, so yeah, if you just hang fire here, you just come to a stop and see it. There you go, it's gone. Well done, the car, fabulous. 
Okay. This is the location you can use for turning the rod. Okay. Right. Okay. Got out a roll? Out of roll. Tell me about all that. Right. Clutch control was okay. left a bit to be desired. So how do you think that's going to impact on the next bit? It's going to have a detrimental effect. <laughs> It is. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So, anything else? Tell me about the. Tell me about the drive. Um, your um, your observations, as far as I could see, were, were good. I was watching out for them. Mm -hmm. I did notice that your indicator flicks back after you've indicated, doesn't yeah, it? it? Does yeah. yeah. It's, a, it's a Vauxhall thing. <laughs> yeah. Um, but you did notice. I banged it straight back, and I'm yeah. not letting it cause it. Yeah. Issue. Yeah, I did notice that. So, also the clutch control. It hasn't been so bad that you needed to stop no. to talk about it. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Why would I do that? Why what, in and roll? Because you want to get to this destination. Correct. But you want me to notice it. Correct. Right. So I'm, I'm on it. It was it was there. I'd see that you noticed it. So how did it manifest itself? Well, I noticed it straight away because we rolled back for a bit. Yeah. Um, so straight away, I was I thought this is where how we're running with this. Okay. Why else did I roll back? Um, breaks, because, uh, let me think. I gave you a hint. You, you weren't finding the biting point before. Uh, I found the bite, didn't I? Because I had the car balanced. Yeah. I then moved forward, and then it rolled back. So it rolled back. What did I say at that point? I oh, didn't see. Oh, th that was another thing I was going so, to mention. Observations. Oh, observation. I did actually say it. We'll, we'll, look, we'll look at your yeah. observations. So again, I've given you a hint. Oh, yeah. I, yeah. But I think I said something, he took me by surprise there. Yes. Because clearly I'm not watching. Yes. So my observations aren't brilliant. Yes. So that's something yeah. else that, is yeah. that going to cause you an issue here? Uh, yes. If you let it. Yes. <laughs> so there was the observations, but you were pretty good with your other observations. I didn't spot anything else particularly. Why would I do that in Raw, do you think? Because you want it, you want to alert me to it so that when we come to this situation, mm -hmm. I'm onto it. But then why, did, why, ah, you did do it more, you did do it more, you did it more when we were, when the bin man issue, okay. and I noticed that you were a bit hesitant, you've been a bit hesitant on a couple of occasions, mm -hmm. um, and that was one of them, because once we concluded he was going around the corner, now the only reason why I thought perhaps you were being a little bit hesitant in that instant was because I'd tried to hold you a little, back a little bit from the bin Thing, so you know, I would either way, but either way, the way I've played it is yeah. I don't want you stopping and diverting away from topic. Right. Because if I'd been too bad, if my observations hadn't been, you'd have been put, yeah. hang on, let's pull over here. Hang on, where is it in here? That's off PST. Yes. So I can't really do that. I'm trying yeah. to alert you to the fact that my observations aren't brilliant. Yes. They're all right. Yeah. But they're not brilliant. No. Um, clearly, I observed the police car going the wrong way around there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did observe that. I just that. I thought, you've got to be kidding me. You <laughs> then, can't really have just yeah, done that. But I didn't spot it. Because <laughs> I was too busy watching you. <laughs> now, in a situation like that, it's worth investigating this. In a situation like that, the examiner will keep you safe. Yeah. He, he won't go and, and cause an issue there. Uh, same with the bin wagon. I got close, but not so close that it was uncomfortable. But was but I right to, to make, mention it? Definitely. Right. Definitely. I'd be chatting a little bit more on the way here. Tell well, me about I this, tell me about that. I did, you know what, I was thinking, I feel, you know, because it's a little bit awkward, the silence bit, mm -hmm. and, and I mean, with you, that's fine, but in an exam situation, that actually might make you feel a little bit uneasy. Mm. I mean, I can see, I, from this seat, I can tell that you're watching me, mm. and that you're keeping an eye on what's going on. Um, you've mentioned about the clutch control, okay, well, we'll have a chat about that, so you get, this is the first time you've had the opportunity to stop with okay. you. Yeah. So we'll have a chat about it, yeah. So it can form part you of the right, Yeah, because what I was thinking on the way here was, right, I've spotted the clutch control problem. Mm -hmm. I don't really know how to tackle it now. Okay. Um, because if I did, did I say, or I thought about saying, I don't know if I did say gently lift your clutch up. At one point I might have said, or uh, I, I thought about saying it, I but I don't didn't. think so, but we'll review yeah. the video and find yeah, out later. Yeah, yeah. Um, I might have thought about saying it, but mm. didn't. Um, so... I kind of, I didn't know how to bring in the core competency bits now, okay. if you know what I mean, at that stage. <laughs> so if we think about how we're going to play the next bit, mm. the things you've noticed on the way here, even if you've not spotted them there, or you've not done anything about them there, you've got the opportunity now. Yes. Um, and as part of, you know, you, you asked me the question yesterday about 
would it be okay just to do some clutch control yeah. back and forward? Yeah. Well, you can justify that now, can't you? Yeah. Because, okay, this is a, a manoeuvre where we're going to have to have yeah. control and you don't seem to have good control of this. So what I'd like to do is to do some work on that first. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's a justifiable so, position, isn't it? As as the instructor, I can say to you now, you know, I've been because you want to give them some positive mm -hmm, feedback, don't mm -hmm. you? You know, I, you, you've been quite good. You, you know, you've, you, I'd noticed your mirrors were good, mm -hmm. and you know, and you got so safe. Mm. <laughs> Nobody died. No, yeah, um, you know, so you, you, your general driving's okay. It's good, you know, for the standard we'd expect you to be at. So it's a little lumpy, isn't it? Yes. Little yeah. bit. A yeah. little bit, but yeah. nothing that's going to cause yeah. you too many issues that's yeah. going to make you divert from the lesson. Yeah. I'm driving at the sort of standard I'd expect. somebody at this stage would be asking. Yeah, because you don't want to be too negative, yeah. but then you can't praise them too much because there's issues. In case it's wrong, yeah. Yeah. So, so, so And it is a strange one, isn't it? In the real yeah. world, you'd never get somebody who was really good at mirror work and poor at observation. No. It wouldn't happen. No. <laughs> it's just, no. you're either good at observation or you aren't. Yeah, so. yeah. But you've got to know what to say to <laughs> you, haven't you? So, yeah. Yeah. so you know, lumpies are good to yeah. use. Lumpy's fine, yeah. Your clutch control's a bit lumpy. So we'll work on that. Um, so then I can sort of say to you, <clears throat> so what I'd like... <clears throat> so what I'd like... You to, so then I'll say, what, do, what I'd like you to do now is... And then try and get you to move backwards okay. and forwards and do a bit of practice. Right, so we'll, we'll, we'll move on to that one in a minute. Right. But looking back on what we've just done, is there anything you do differently if you rerun the whole thing? If I rerun the whole thing... Mm -hmm. I'd have piped up sooner about the the bin man, but then I, I wasn't expecting I wasn't expecting that situation. I mm. think um, I'm not sure. Okay. Should I have piped up sooner about the bin if man? If you're thinking it, see it. Just get straight in. Yeah. You hold back here. Now the reason yeah. I've got you to hold back back here is <laughs> because of this, 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 or this. Yeah. Um, so well, yeah, that, if you're thinking yeah. it, just get it out. I did say it a little bit, didn't mm. I? But it was too late. I said it too late. I but you recovered around the corner on yeah. the next one. Hang yeah. back, hang back. Hang back, oh, yeah. Right, okay, so I did. Yeah. Uh, I followed the command that you'd given me. Yeah. So anything else you might do different? I'm, I'm not, not suggesting that there is. I'm not fine. sure, no, I don't think so. Okay, that's fine. I, I don't think so. But I'd like to know if there should be something I would do different. We all we're all different, and we would all do things a different way. But have you missed anything out? Are um, you armed with the right information? Do you think to be able to help you proceed? I think so. Did you need to pull me over for anything? I felt like it a little bit, but I I, I didn't feel like there was enough to warrant me to yeah, pull you over. Yeah, so that's fine. Yeah. yeah. And, I, and I was deliberately trying to play it so that I'm alerting you to it but not so bad, it's yeah. delicate balance, yeah. but not so bad that you divert off topic. Yeah. Um, you're never going to drive very far no. to get to the location. This is phase one, isn't it, this, it turning is. the road phase it one? Is. Right. So you, it's quite acceptable to pull someone over. It is. Had well, I don't, I don't think it matters what stage they're at. If you, you're thinking, hmm, just pull over. Right, okay. If he's, let's say you pull me over for something and he wants to get here, He'll, he'll fix it pretty quick. Okay. Um, he doesn't want to live because you haven't got much time on okay. the exercise, so he doesn't want to limit the time that you've got available. So okay. he's alerting you to things that might be wrong. Um, in this case, obviously, my observations and and my uh, my clutch control aren't brilliant. How's my steering action? Oh yeah, I did. I did notice a little bit. It was a bit. It wasn't brilliant. But again. It, like what you're saying, in a kind of way, it's about the level you really. expect it. Yeah. I'm a bit, I'm a bit. Yeah. Rather than... And you're a bit jerky at times. Yes. I did notice. So again, I'm alerting but you I should to have the said that. that, I should have said it's it. It's okay, but I'm still, you've, yeah. I'm, just, I'm alerting you to the fact that this might be an issue for you. Yeah. So, that's all three areas, control, observation, accuracy, that I'm going to display problems with. Mm. So yeah, forewarned is forearmed. Mm. I suspect there's nothing you could do on the way here that's going to cure it. Mm. Otherwise, I would then have to do this perfect and I'm not going to. Mm. Does no. that make sense? You will. <laughs> that's the spirit. <laughs> okay, so we've... Love it. So we've got ourselves to the location. Yeah. You've dealt with whatever on the way. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Um, and they're quite often out of the, you know, just correct any things that you see in me driving on the way to the location. There, there won't be, there won't be anything that requires too much work. But do mention, mm. sometimes we're bringing the clutch up a bit quick. Mm. It's a bit smooth. Let's make a few lumps there. Mm. We'll need to have a look at that when we get there because that mm. might cause us some issues with this. And you're learning under the fact that you're you're on it. Mm. Yeah. Um, just not just taking little movements on the steering. Mm. We should really be working the steering really hard. When we come to do turn on the road, you're going to need to have bigger movements on the steering. Yeah. And I've noticed your observations are a bit. Mm, when we're doing turn on the road, we've yeah, got to be aware right. all around because we're yeah. sideways onto the oncoming traffic, so we need to really up our game in the observation sticks. All right, okay. So you've not stopped yeah. him to do anything about it, no. but you've alerted him to the fact that you're on him. Yeah. And that that's going to form part of your plan when you get it. So I could have been saying all of this. Yeah, you, could, you know, when you were thinking it. Yeah. Just say it. Say it, yeah. Uh, and and, and, and think apply out loud. it. Apply it to what we're doing. <laughs> yeah. So just think out loud. Right. Okay. It's as easy as that. <laughs> well, that's if a, you're that's wrong, a dangerous it's, it's game. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell him everything you're thinking. <laughs> <laughs> that, that could land you in trouble. Uh, yeah. <laughs> And by the way, you're ugly too. <laughs> yeah, that might not help. I can't say that. I think my examiner is a female. <laughs> All right, okay, cool. Thanks. Okay, so we're at the location. Yeah. Um, you've driven here. He will stop and say, this location will be suitable. Mm-hmm. Um, he's not going to try and trick you. Um, if you're not sure, just say, well, are you sure this is a suitable location? What tells us that? Or whatever. Yeah. Well, what does concern me are these cars are coming down, whizzing down this road quite fast. Yeah, this is where they do it on test you. Is it? It is. Flipping it. Yeah. Right. So, well, in a way, it's good that we're practicing here because. Well, we do have this lay by the side, which is where the traffic will go ah, if we're sideways on. Oh, yeah, good thinking, Batman. <laughs> Not my thinking, the example. <laughs> <laughs> so, there is an escape route for them. Right. Okay. So. Back in roll. Do we get some effing and jeffing from them <laughs> that we did? <laughs> Sometimes. Yeah, right, okay. Well, so be it. Right, yeah, back in roll. Okay. Okay, so Bob, this is where we're going to do our turn in the road. All right, okay. Okay, but before we do, on the way here, I did notice that your, um, your clutch control was a little bit bumpy. Oh, is it? All oh, right. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's fine, mm-hmm. it's acceptable. You know, for the level that you're at. Right. But we'll just iron those few issues out. There was, there was a couple of issues with the steering as well. I did notice you. You were a bit. You weren't doing bigger. You could have been doing bigger hand movements. Right. So when we're doing the turn in the road, we have to make big hand oh, movements. Right, right. Okay. So using the push, the pull and push method. Right. We'll be doing this, but steering big, big. Right. Okay. Because we've got to get the car around. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, so that will require okay. big turns. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, and observations. I did notice when we set off, a car from the right surprised you a little bit. He did, yeah, yeah. 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 So you, you you need to make sure that you're looking all around the car because oh, right, right. here particularly, you're going to be across the road, aren't you? You're going to be straddled, yeah, right, and yeah. cars are coming quite fast around this corner. They are, yeah. So we will need to be mindful of oh, okay. traffic. Okay. Mm-hmm. So first things first, what I want you to do is I want to I want you to demonstrate first of all your clutch control. Oh, okay. Because if there are any little elements that we're not quite con- happy with, it will show when we do the turn in the road. All right. All right. So we'll have a little bit of a practice here. We'll go backwards and forwards. Okay. Because I know you've not been backwards before, have you? No. No. So we'll 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 practice that for a little bit. Okay. And then we'll introduce, when we're content with that, right. that we're at a standard that we'll need to be at to get around. All right, okay. Then we'll we'll move ahead. Okay. okay? So, do you want to prepare the car in your normal way? Okay. Right, so put your clutch right down. Select first gear. Right. Now, you show me, first of all, how you'd find your biting point. Right, okay. Now at that point there you can feel the pull. If you let your hand brake off now we'd go too fast. Would we? Yeah. So just put your clutch back down slightly. Whoop, that's enough. Just a pound coin thickness. Alright. Right. Now I'll take your hand brake off and see what happens. Okay, good. Now, right. if you gently control it by lifting up your clutch. Whoa, no, too fast. Okay. So that's okay. We can get another shot. So prepare the car again. Okay. 
so set a bit of gas a little bit more slightly that's enough pound coin thickness right now gently slowly bring up your clutch slowly right there now that would be too fast so put your clutch back down slightly pound, only a pound right bring it up again only a pound coin thickness to take it back down about there now take your handbrake off do your observations no pop a blind spot observation Gently, gently, only a paper, paper thickness, bring up your clutch. Right, now bring it, take it back down again. Right, now bring it slightly back up. Can you see how you're moving slightly? Right, okay. So you're a bit bumpy, aren't you? You're not keeping your feet still. Once you've decided the speed you want to go at, right. you need to keep your feet still. All right. And just gently let it roll forward. Right. Do you understand? We'll go backwards, we'll try it backwards. Right. Are you happy to do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. All right then, so clutch down. That's uh, over there, isn't it? Yeah. Is it, you have to make sure it's properly in. Okay, is it in reverse? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. All right. Okay, so gently lift your clutch up. Find a bite of that, that's too much. Okay. Did you feel that? Yeah. That tells you it's too much. All right. Okay. So, just do your observations. Have a look round. Check your blind spot. That's it. Now it's the first time you're going backwards. So where do you need to look? Uh, backwards. That's right. You do need to look backwards, but look through the back window. Oh. Right. Can you see? Yeah. Can you see clearly? Mm -hmm. All right. So. That's enough. Right. Put your clutch back down. No. Now, see, can you feel how that was too fast? Mm. Okay. No, too fast. Okay, so just put some brake on for a moment. All right, stop the car. Okay, put your handbrake on. Put it into neutral. Okay, now, let's see. Why? You can see that we feel that you're moving too fast. It's Do you feel agree too with fast. that? No, it's slow. Well, it's too fast because Is if it? you were doing that speed as you were doing the turn in the road, you would very quickly lose control. Look how far we've travelled, and we've only you only just slightly lift the clutch, didn't you? Oh, and we yeah. travelled all the way back here. Now right. think about that across the road. You're not going to get time. You're not going to get time to steer. All oh, right. Because it's much slower than that then. Much slower. Oh, right, you need to okay. be walking pace. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Walking pace, but you yeah. need to be smooth. It needs to be smooth. Right. So when you lift your clutch, when you feel a biting point, just gently put your clutch back down again, just about a pound coin thickness. Okay. And then gently, you might even find you don't need any gas. Right. Okay, so try that. Let's see what goes, what happens with that. That's Do you want me to go forwards or backwards? Forwards. Oh, sorry. So take your foot off the gas. Just gently slow it. No, that's too much. Okay. <laughs> okay, secure the car. That's it. Right. So, we're gently bringing the clutch up. Alright. So, select gear. Have a look round. Do your observations. Make sure you've done your blind spot. Now, listen to the engine tone. Right, now that would be too fast. So, if you bring your foot up, Right about there, now, do your observations. Keep your feet still. Keep your feet still, take your handbrake off. Keep your feet still. Right, now gently, gently, slowly lift your clutch up. That's it, now that's the speed we're looking at. Right there, gently, slowly, put your clutch back down again. All right. Oh, no, that's too fast. Right. Right, just put that by some brake. Pass and brake, stop there. That's it. Right, put your handbrake on. It's neutral. Now, when we did it initially there, and I said that's the speed we were looking at, mm -hmm. do you know how to maintain that speed? Because no. then we started to pick up speed at the end, didn't we? No, I don't know how that happened. Right. Can we just break out a roll? Okay. <laughs> so, I can see what you're trying to do. <laughs> can you? <laughs> Think about your core comps. Where right. are you at in that, in that cycle? Yeah, because I was right. Let's do the let's do the sheets. The sheet. Um, 
You know what I was thinking to myself? I need to ask why. Why is he not doing it right? Well, I did ask, but you said, oh, I don't know, didn't you? Well, if you just asked, that's right. So, so if then, I'm saying to you, I don't know, what am I telling you? Um, I don't know, you're telling me. You said, I mean, do you know how to control the speed like that? No. Mm. How might I find that out? Well, I thought that's what we were doing. <laughs> No. Well, you're going to hold it still, but then of course, it, if you hold it still, it does gradually pick speed up. Yeah. So it'll be. Do, so, so if you hold the clutch still, it, it will. You're just nibbling away, if you like. Yeah. So we need to constantly adjust to keep the speeds the same. If you hold it the same place, yeah. it yeah. will gradually build up. Yeah. So I was right when I was going mm. along the lines of keep your feet still. Yeah, yeah, keep your fine. feet still. But if the speed picks up, clutch down. Push down a bit, up a bit, down a bit, down a bit. So yeah. you're making it happen from your side. Remember, yeah. in your cycle was, of core yeah. comps, you've told me it's too fast. Yeah. You've said to me, look, if you're doing that on the turn of the road, you'll never get it around yeah. there. I say, oh no, right, oh. Okay, so I'm kind of, I'm buying in with that. Yeah. You're now talking me through it. Yeah. But you've only done half the talk through. Yes. You're allowing things to go wrong. Remember, yes. we're in talk through phase. Yeah. And I'm as dumb as a box of rocks. Yeah. So I. I did nearly get it at one you point nearly, nearly, yeah. because I nearly said, I, I said, right, put your foot up down, put your foot up, up. and then I was like thinking, nah, I'm losing this, I'm losing this. <laughs> right, okay, let's. So you're on the right track, but yeah. we're in the talk through phase on yeah. that core comps, aren't we? Yeah. With this particular problem. Mm. Right. Shall we go back into roll? Off yeah. you go. So, back in roll. Right, back in roll. Okay, so we've had a good practice. Well, we've had a little bit of a practice at that, and we're mm -hmm. not quite mastering it yet. All right. All right. Okay. So we'll have another go. It was good that you went backwards, by the way, because I know that's your first time you've ever done that. Mm. So we'll we'll give it another go. We'll go backwards again, okay. and we'll try and master this clutch control. Okay. All right. So clutch down. Make sure you're in neutral. Uh, no, that won't get you anywhere. Make sure you're in reverse. Leave the car in one piece. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Right, yeah, so we're in reverse. Um, so just bring your clutch up gently and fit slower than that. Right, put it back down again. Now, can you feel the car when it's lifting? Mm. You know that's your biting point, don't you? Yeah. You remember from your previous yeah, lessons? Yeah. All right. So when you feel that, you then move in too fast, you're still bringing your clutch up quite fast. All right, right. So it's around that biting point mm -hmm. where you need to be very, very careful. Right. And that's where your control comes from. All right. Okay. So if you gently bring your foot up off the clutch, right, that's enough. Did you feel that slight engine chair? Oh, hear yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Right. Now that's around the area you need to be. Right. All right. Now it might require you to push up, put your foot down a little bit and up a little bit. Only a fraction. We're talking even paper thin. Oh, okay. All right. So if you mm -hmm. imagine that in your mind. Right. So as, you, as you're bringing your foot up, it'll make it go faster. Right. If you put your foot slightly back down again, it will slow it down. Okay. So that speed I was talking about before is the speed we want to be going. So okay. you're in reverse, do your observations, keep your feet still, keep your feet still, because you're almost there. All right now, so take your handbrake right now. Gently lift your paper thin, lift it now. Put it back down, now lift it. Put it back down, now look out the back window. Now, no, too fast, so push it back down again. That's it. Oh, Are you getting that? All right, so gently put it back down again. That's, this is the sort of speed, even slower still. Wow, well, that really is slow. Yeah. Okay. Right, so if you gently put your foot, foot down and press your brake, foot on the clutch and press your brake, that's it. So how do you feel about that? That's really slow. Do you feel in control though? Yeah. Do you feel like you, you'd not get let that run away with you? You, you can control that, that I speed? I think so, yeah. yeah. Oh, good. Let's practice it again. Right. But we'll do the same going forwards. Okay. All right. Because you'll be more confident going forwards anyway. Oh, okay. All right. Right. So, prepare your car. Make sure you do your observations. Nice, but that's it. Right now, gently in the same way. 
No, that's a little bit fast, isn't it? That's perfect. A bit lumpy, do it more smoothly. That's the sort of speed we're looking at. Which feels awfully slow. Well, it is, but it'll give you plenty of time to do what you need to do to get across the road. Oh, okay. How's that feel? Crazy slow. But, well, this is the this is the speed we need to be going. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. All right. So if you pop you back up, that's it. Right. How did that feel? Very slow, but okay. All right. Okay. Just out of roll for a minute. Okay. Are you telling me I'm going instructing too slow? No. Oh, is that all right? Um, has he ever travelled this slow before? No. So feels very slow. Yeah. And you're right, this is the speed that we need. Yeah. So you can do what you've done there, mm. but just get on it quicker. Quicker. Make it happen. Yeah. And then it's only going to take mm. you a couple of minutes. Mm. Where at the minute we're kind of second guessing, just make it happen. Mm. If you're thinking about, if you're going to tackle it as mm. a problem, you've got to go around the core comps, you've got to talk, you've got to tell mm. me what the problem is. Mm. You've got to so get I've me done on board. That, I? I've not got yeah. any machine. Where's me? Oh, I've got is. one, but it's half filled in. We'll I'll pick do it them all off the floor, get a sort. I've, I've got, I thought I had them, I thought I'd clipped them on here. Right. I thought, well I thought I'd seen them this morning, but it must have just yeah, been the one. Yeah, no, I think I did have them, I don't know what's happened to them since. Them so, um, clutch control. So it's, if you're going to tackle it before you do the turn of the road, you need to fix it. Yeah. Very quickly. Yeah. Or just wait until he starts with the turn of the road and go, stop, that's too quick. Yeah. And then do it. Yeah. Otherwise, you could end up spending a lot of time on that and you haven't even briefed me on turn of the road yet. Yeah, that's so true. So that's the danger. Yes. So I would brief on turn of the road, then do that exercise. Would you? Yes. All right. And then okay. you've got your brief done, haven't you? You're done yeah. with that. Yeah, okay. So, but just before we do that, let's test out clutch control. Right. And then fix it. Right. That's okay. But right. At the, the rate we're going, you might run out of time. Yeah. And that'll be a nightmare to yeah. fix that and then go, that's out of time and you not even tackle the subject. Right, okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. So we have got time constraints as well, haven't we? Of course so, we have. 28 minutes. So the only thing that was wrong there was I wasn't I wasn't getting you to pump it. Do you know what I think all the issue is? In some cars that would have probably would have rolled it enough, but in other cars it wouldn't have done. But it's feeling the difference and knowing mm. the difference, isn't it? Why would it not work with this car today? We're not, we're not on a hill or anything. No, it's because I don't want it to. <laughs> right. It's as simple as that. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to be too fast. Yeah. Because I don't realise how slow it needs to be, so I've got to make sure it's too fast. Yeah. Okay. So, you know, you're saying before, like, holding your feet, holding your feet still will, it will gradually pick up speed. Mm. But I have to pick up thinking. a little bit of speed because I did bring the clutch yeah. up a little bit because yeah. I'm wanting to demonstrate that I don't know what I'm doing here. Yeah. This is a problem you need to fix it. Yeah. Now, if you've just gone to this and kept it tight, yeah. So any time we're looking at any fault, get straight into your core comps. Mm -hmm. This is a problem. This is why it's a problem. Get me on board. Now I'm going to talk you through it. And mm -hmm. go up a bit, down a bit, down a bit, up a bit. The bit that you, the way you did it at mm -hmm. the end. Yeah. Do that at the beginning. Right. Don't wait for me to get it right because I'm not going to. No. Never. Right. Never am I going to get that right. Right. Without your input. Right. So. I'm not a proper learner. Steering. The steering. We can't really. How do we tackle Just, that until we're doing it? Well, yeah. Right. And you'll get the chance then. But it's it's the, the the steering is not going to cause you as much of an issue as the, the, the clutch control. No, no. Um, um, and then the observations. Are... So just be careful that you don't get pulled away from the subject matter. Yeah. Um, yeah. And if you do get pulled away like that, and that, that's a, it's an okay thing to do, but if you're going to do that, do it quick. Yeah. Let me turn this off. I thought I'd turn that off. It's all right. Um, so the reason why, well, the reason why. So in your analysis, the reason why. Let me think. Um, well, in a way, it's, it's your inexperience, isn't it? So it's. Well, you made you, a, you made a good enough case for me to say, oh, right, you're saying it needs to be slow because you know if you're travelling that fast, you won't have time to do what you're going to do. Oh, yeah. okay, that's fine. Yeah. So I would get here, do the brief on on turning the road first. Right. Okay. And then, if you want to, do some work on the clutch control. Right. Okay, doke. Right. But so doing the brief first going to then keep you on track. All right then. So can we come back to the analysis in a minute, or do you think? Of course we've, we can. We've, I mean, you can do it now, that's fine. All right then. Um, so analysis, reason why, um, because, um, you see, I can't really make, I'm not. Is there another way you could do this analysis, do you think? 
to you, spot that it's a problem. Yeah. You've told me that it's a problem. Yeah. Could you deal with the analysis during your brief? Yeah, probably. Well, part of the analysis is why it's a problem. This is why we do it. This is why doing it the way you do it would be a problem. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Okay. So again, we're still just thinking yeah. of packaging the thing in the correct way. Yeah. But I can talk to you about why it's dangerous. Of course you can. So the reason it's dangerous is because if we lose control during the turn in the road, mm -hmm. we could end up up the curb. Yeah. You know, we could we could frighten uh, people walking by. We I could... think I think we have to be careful about how we do it though. I think I mean we've mm -hmm. talked about doing this little exercise with a cl clutch before you do turn the road, mm -hmm. but I would do it after you've done the brief. Otherwise, you're going to sidetrack mm. yourself the way you just did. Right, okay. So, brief next. So, as soon as you get here, right. talk about the brief, <laughs> but also bring in, I noticed on the way here that your clutch control is a bit quick, so we need, to, we need to be making the car move a lot slower than that. Yeah. Observations, we need to be taking more observations because we're sideways to traffic. Uh, yeah. steering, you're going to need to have bigger movements on this time, on this way, so you can use that. And yeah. that's your analysis, because you're seeing you need bigger movements because of, you need to be, have better observations because of. Yeah. Um, so you're, you're doing your analysis there. Mm. Those things are still going to come up as a problem, and you're then going to still have to go through your core comps. Mm. But you're sort of you're using the, the drive here. You're linking that to this. Mm. Um, you might be able to. You might not. You might not mm. demonstrate any faults. Mm. Um, but I think <laughs> you better add now. <laughs> <laughs> I think there, there was a danger there that you, you you took yourself down an alley and got stuck there. Yes. Um, and I'm sat here looking at the clock thinking. Yeah, not going to run out of time yet. This is what I'm worried about. Mm. I am a bit worried about Draw. time on the on the. By all means, talk about the drive. Talk about it while you're on the drive, but get to the the subject matter. Okay. You can bring in everything you've noticed on the drive while you're briefing me on this. Right. And it'll be the same for any subject where you're driving to a location to do a brief. Yeah. Because you will demonstrate the faults that are relevant to the subject. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. And you'll not do them at a level where you need to intervene too much mm. on the way. But if you feel that you're doing review, that's fine. Mm. Does that make sense? Do you know what I, I, I'm thinking now, whilst I'm doing this brief, just making a little note in the corner of mm. the issues. Yeah, fine. So, so um, clutch, steering, just to remind me that I've definitely got to make an okay. emphasis of, on these points. Now I have one of these yeah. that has this fault grid yeah, you on do. every page. I've seen it, yeah. So I will print them out and see if they work for you. Yeah. So clutch steering and what um, clutch steering observations. Mm -hmm. Ops, right. I just turned that off. <laughs> it's persistent. <clears throat> so, are we back in Rome? <laughs> yes. Okay. We've just arrived. Yeah. Would I ask the person to switch the engine off? Yeah. Okay. Right. So, right, Bob. We're going to look at how exactly we go about this turning the road okay all right so we start off in this position mm -hmm. which is about where we are now right okay we're particularly mindful when we're doing a turn in the road about things um like posts like that that post there all right yeah, bus stop mm -hmm. and this bin here all right yeah so you need to really ideally avoid situations where you've got things on the edge of the road all right, right. all right but we're all right here where we are we, okay. they shouldn't get in our way Okay, so the idea is that we start in this position here, so I'll, I'll hold it this way. Okay, yeah. We can relate to it better, can't we? So you'll move across using clutch control. Mm -hmm. So are we pretending I've done this already or have not? No, we don't. We've not done that. No. Right. So moving very, very slowly. The pen's running out. <laughs> Oh, I'm in red now, that's, that means trouble. Moving very, very slowly. Mm -hmm. We'll be moving our car to this position here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we're using clutch control. All right. Um, I know that on the way here, we did we did struggle a little bit with that. All right. so we'll go through that in a moment and oh, how, okay. how we can make that right. Okay. Mm -hmm. But the idea of this is that we need to go ultra slow. Okay. All right. We've got to big, make big stairs. Okay, to the right, mm -hmm. to get ourselves in this position. All right, now that's position one. Then we will be backing up to position two. All right. Mm -hmm. And then we'll be moving forward to position three. And we'll have completed our turn. All right. 
right. Now, at this point here, somewhere along here, we will stop the car because we'll need to think about our reference points. We will need reference points because we'll need to know where to stop the car before we mount the curb. Okay. Right. We don't want to mount the curb. Okay. All right. So we'll think about a reference point here. Mm -hmm. Okay. And at that point, what we do is we steer in the opposite direction because we want to put our wheels in this direction to prepare us for moving backwards. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you if you're feeling a bit confused about it now, it might come clear as we do it. All right. Okay. All right. So then we move backwards mm -hmm. and we steer to the anti-clockwise. Mm -hmm. Okay. To put ourselves in that position. All right. And then when we're about here, we'll do what we've done the first time. Mm -hmm. We'll stop ourselves. We'll have a look out the window and we'll decide where a reference point will be mm -hmm. so that we'll know when to start steering in that direction. Okay. Okay. The important thing throughout all of this is to remember to go nice and slow. Mm -hmm. Steer with big steer movements because you've got a lot of steering to do in a small space. Right. Okay. Yeah. And observing. So when we start off, we've got to observe all the way around the car. Mm -hmm. Okay. We have to look down the pavement, make sure nobody's coming. If there's anyone, you know, any cyclists, have a look in our blind spot to make sure it's it's safe to go. Okay, we'll do the same once we get into this position. So we'll need to. The last place we look is the direction that we're moving in. Oh. So we'll look all the way around the car and then in that direction. Okay, mm -hmm. making sure we've checked all our blind spots and then again before we set off. We'll check this way, and then lastly, we'll have a look round, and we'll check that way. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. How do you feel about that? Uh, okay, I think. Okay. Is there anything you'd like to ask? Um, no, I don't think so. Okay. <coughs> there is. We have got another. It's a lot to remember, isn't it? There is. Yeah. We have got here. We've got another issue. We've got camber. Okay. This is what we call a camber. It's for the drainage. So the centre of the road is on a slight hill. I don't know if you've noticed that. Can you see that? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. So what we might find is when we're rolling down that way, we might find that just taking the clutch to the biting point and not using any gas but covering the brake will be safer because we'll be in a position to slow down and stop before we hit the curb. Right. Going back that way, so as we're setting off, we might need a little bit of gas, mm -hmm. but we'll get that balance, we'll practice that balance. Okay. Okay, between clutch control and gas. And then this way it'll be probably, we may roll down the hill. Right. Okay, so we'll need to cover our brake. Okay. And then going backwards, because we're going up the hill, we we'll may need a bit of gas, but then coming back down this side of the road, we might need more brake. All right, okay. Are you all right with that? Yeah, Do you I think, think so, yeah. yeah. Okay, well let's give it a go. Okay. Nothing you want to ask? No, no, it's just a, there's a lot to remember. There is. There is a lot to remember. Um, but we'll talk through it. We'll I'm work a bit worried about that. Oh, yeah. Mm. Right, out of roll for a minute. Sorry. I know you're hinting at something and I don't know what it is. <laughs> what do you think it may be? Am I waffled on too much? No. What would you say to a real life? Well, there's a lot to remember there. I'd say I know. But the more you practice it, the better you'll get and the less you'll have to remember because you'll do it automatically. Oh, I think I'm still worried though. A bit scared, really. <laughs> a bit scared. Should I be I'm scared? Uh, no. Why not? Well, well you'd be a bit. Um, Sorry, it's saying don't be scared. Yeah, um, well, scared? you might be a little bit nervous. I am. I am. <laughs> I'm a bit scared, to be honest, the so, way these cars are flying around this corner. So, we're really like, so well, don't worry, that's what I'm here for. I'll talk you through it. Yeah. I was go I was <laughs> that's about, what I wanted I was from you. I was about to say that, and then I thought, Who's but I'm not remember? much help because I'm a little bit worried. <laughs> <laughs> so, if you met with that, that's, that's me just trying to get out of you. Well, look, don't worry, I'm going to talk you through this. All right, okay. Right. So, yeah. Or was that it? So my instinct was right in to say that. Yeah. It's just I didn't say it because I was actually pooping myself. Uh, myself. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, oh okay. 
I'll try not now. Mm-hmm. So don't worry, I'm going to talk you through it. I'm going to talk you through it. All right, brilliant. I'll be here. I'm right by your side. There you go. And, All right, oh, good. And you've got a learner on the top. People understand. Yeah. We've all got to start somewhere. There you go. Okay. So I'm checking. Are you listening to what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Cool. I just didn't know how to respond to it. Well, you can nearly, you can nearly almost, funny enough, Todd Apollos, one of it, you can almost always finish every brief with, but don't worry, I know there's a lot to remember. I'm going to talk you through it. Yeah. Right. All right. Oh, cool. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. I was a bit worried about the camera thing because I, I do struggle with getting that in my head with the clutch control. I just do it automatically and I uphill, do struggle. Downhill. Yeah. I, clutch I, and gas. Clutch and gas. Well, <laughs> gas and clutch on the other way down. Clutch down and brake. So, don't even come up the bike going down the hill. Clutch no. down. You might say, is that not coarsen? Yeah, but it doesn't matter. Because you're only doing it for a few feet. Right. Most important thing is that we go slow. Yeah. Give yeah. yourself time to do what you need to do. So if you'd have said that on the exam, oh yeah, but in that, in that coasting, I'd have gone... <gasps> say what it is, but it doesn't matter. Because <laughs> it doesn't, does it? No, no. <laughs> no. So no. again, when you're doing the brief, just think about what would you do? Mm. What would you do going across there? Mm. Um, and just talk them through it logically in the in the order you would do it. You know, so I'm going to stop here. I'm going to have a look around for the road users. If there's somebody coming, I'll stop. Mm-hmm. I'll work out what they're going to do. Mm-hmm. Now we're going to go downhill now, so I'm probably going to just get the car moving, push the clutch down, just let it roll down, and use the brake just to slow it down before I get the curb. Mm. Um, and if he jumps in with it, it's not that costing. Yeah, but it's okay in this circumstance because you know we're only moving a few feet. Yeah. Then I'm going to get the ro- the car ready, checking all around. Looking through the back window before I move, mm-hmm. finding the bike, move it really slowly, get the rest of the steering on. So just you're just doing a a commentary on what you would do in the yeah. order in which you would do it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> so now at this point, we're about to start. So can we imagine? Do we imagine that I've I've just done that bit that we did yep. before? So you just finished the brief. You say, look, probably the most important thing here is the speed control. So mm-hmm. before we start turning sideways to traffic, let's just see see what we've got in terms of speed control. Mm-hmm. Just just let me see how you're going to control the speed of the car going forward. Mm-hmm. And he's going to do it too fast, and you're going to get into what you got into before. Yeah. Then when you fix that, yeah. and that's talk through twice, prompt mm-hmm. twice, on his own. So yeah. forward, back, talk through. Yeah. Forward, back, prompted. Forward, back, on his own. Mm. Should Pat I practice on the head. that? You can if you want. Yes, let's do it. Okay. I know we did it before, but I'm on it better now. Okay, cool. So well, I mean, this is uh, this is what you wanted to do. Yep, break it into exactly. chunks. And that, that's exactly. fine. Break you can review the chunks. video and, and have a look at yep. where you're at and what we're doing and okay. how all of that works. And also, in terms of uh, the exam, roughly where are we up to now? Are we about halfway through the exam already? Probably a th- um, you're probably a third of the way through phase one. Right. So you're probably ten minutes in. Jesus, a lot's happened, doesn't it, in that ten yeah. minutes? Yeah. It just yeah. goes to show how quick it is. Mm. Well, the reality is, I mean, you, you took yourself off on a, on a little track that took you about seven or eight minutes earlier on with the, the, mm. the attempt and the clutch control thing. Mm. And I think by jumping in there, it's a great idea to do it, but I think by jumping in there early with that, before you've done the brief and stuff, it's, yeah. it's you've lost the structure. Yes. Um, yeah. So I think the structure always is when you've arrived, do the brief. But by all means, bring in stuff that's happened on the drive there. Yeah. Or Include analyse the, the problems that have been uh, yeah. and then do the brief and then... Yeah. But careful that you don't get dragged off mm. uh, in a particular direction. I'll just start the engine because we're misting up a little bit. Okay. So, are we back in roll? Back in roll. Okay, so Bob. We've driven here, you've noticed all the bits and pieces, you've given yeah. me the brief, yeah. you've talked to me about the various bits and pieces. Okay. Now we're about to do right. what you want to do. Okay, so we've done the brief and we talked about the control mm-hmm. and the speed. Mm. All right. Now, I did notice on the way here that that was a little bit. A little bit bumpy. Was it all? A little, a little bit, yeah. So let's just tie up that first before, <laughs> so that I know in my mind that you know we've got that control there. Right. It, it'll give you a bit of security as well. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Because you'll feel more in control that way. All right. Yeah. Fair all enough. right. So let's put it into first gear. Okay, you're definitely in first. Yeah. 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 Okay. Just right. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. So. Let's just listen to the engine tone. So if you put your gas slightly on and find your biting point. Right there. Can you hear that? Mm-hmm. Now if you took your handbrake off now, you'd set off too fast. Would it? Yeah, you would. Right. You might be surprised at that, but you would. Oh. All right. So 
I'll tell you what, let's let's try it. If you look round the car, do your observations. Alright, that's it. Take your handbrake off. Right, now that's too fast. So right. just come gently brake and clutch down, gently brake. That's it. That's much too fast. Is it? Much too fast, yeah. Alright. Okay. So let's try that again. Okay. But listen to what I ask you to do before we set off. Alright, okay. okay. So put your clutch down. Yeah. First gear. Yeah. Right, now a little, tiny little bit of gas, tiny. Right, that's enough. Okay. Paper thin. Okay. Now gently bring your clutch up. Right, now that would be too fast. So put your clutch back down a pound coin thickness. Right, gently bring. Right, that's probably enough actually. Oh, Take right. your handbrake off. Just do your observations. That's it. Right. Now, what I'm going to ask you to do now is gently, paper thin, lift your clutch up. Paper thin. Paper thin. Now that's no too fast. So put your clutch back down again. Do it smoothly. No. Put your clutch back down again. That's too fast. Oh. So bring your clutch up. Just just pump your clutch and find that control. Not 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 too much like that. Slower and gentler. Right. That's the sort of speed. No, too fast. Too fast. So put your clutch back down again. That's the sort of speed there. Right there. Can you feel that? No, too fast that. So put your clutch back down. That's a bit too fast, so clutch down. Alright, so if you just pull into the side now, go your brake and sit a little bit further on. Or just in front of somebody who's driving. Just do your observations. Right. Brake and clutch. Now, how did that feel? Put your hand brake on. It's difficult, that, isn't it? Yeah. But can you see how that that's the sort of speed? It's very slow. Yeah, but that's the sort of speed we're looking at. Oh, okay. okay. But you need to do it slightly smoother. Mm. Rather than making more definite movements, you need to make them very, very slight. Oh, right. Extremely slight. Because it makes... Well, am I moving it too much? A, a little bit, yeah. You oh, need right. to... Yeah, let's practice going backwards. Oh, okay. All right. So, put down on clutch, that's it. Make sure you're in reverse. Definitely in reverse, that's yeah. it. Okay, so now do your observations. That's it. Now look out the back window, because that's the way we're going, isn't it? Right, now gently bring your clutch. No, that's too much, too much. Right, that, that's too much. About there, there. Now gently take your handbrake off. Keep your feet still. Keep your feet still, right. Now. Just look where you're going. Slowly bring your clutch up. Paper thin, paper thin. Now push it back down again, that's too fast. Paper thin, that's it. Just push it back down, that's too fast. Right, that's it, gently bring it up. You can just look out the back window, because that's the way you're going. Right, that's too fast. That's it. No, slow down, slow down. That's too fast now, too fast. Keep your clutch down. More gentle movements with your feet. More gentle movements. That's it. Now this is the sort of speed. Even that's slightly too fast. So bring it up. But you're controlling the speed better, aren't you now? Mm. Now that's too fast. So get your clutch down. Get your clutch down. That's it. That's it. That's it. Mm. That's the speed we want. Mm. Just there. Keep your feet still. Keep your feet still. Keep your feet still. That's a bit fast, so just take it. How's that feel? Slow. Slow, yeah. But that's the speed we want. You've got control. Right. And you're safe. Right. Aren't you? So that's it, gently. Great, that's it. So how did you feel about that? Very slow. It's yeah. a bit surprising. Yeah. So, let's do a turn in the road. Well, just over all. <laughs> Have a think about where you are in your core comms. <laughs> How was I doing? Well, you made me do it. Yeah, but was I not very good? Well, you've, you've made me do it. Yeah. I tried to get off the leash, haven't I? Mm. Constantly. Yeah. So you've constantly had to be in. Got down yes. a bit, down a bit. Oh, that's too fast. Oh, down so bit, now you've got to do it on your own. If you let me loose now, you'll do it wrong. I'll wreak havoc. Yes. <laughs> yes. I had a feeling. That, yes, of course. I don't. Yeah, I didn't. Great trust. job. You've made me do it. Yeah. I've worked you hard. Yeah. 
<laughs> and it is hard work, isn't it? Yeah. It's constant. Mm. If, you, if you let up for a mm. second, you've seen yeah. what happens. Yeah. I'm so off. now, now <laughs> I've got to say to you. Now I'm just going to prompt you. You've got to do it again. Well, make sure I'm on board with that. Just say, okay. Oh, you happy? That's to do great it again. stuff. Are you happy if I just yeah. prompt you this time? Okay. Yeah, yeah, I think so. All right. Let's get back in roll now. How do you feel about that? Yeah, all right, I think. Did you Very feel slow, though. It's really it, slow. It, it is slow, but that that will give us the accuracy and the control that we need, and it will oh, keep right. us safe. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's try it again. Right. I'll prompt you every now and again just to remind you. Okay. But let's see if you can do it. Okay. Without with, with less less prompt with less um, of me telling you what to do. Right, right. All right. So, just make sure you do your observations. Oh, oh which way are we going? Well, yeah. Forward, sorry. Not forward, sorry. Sorry. Look around, make sure you observe everything. Right, okay, slow down a bit. Put your clutch down, put your clutch down. So what's happened there? You've, you've gone back to... I set off a bit quick, didn't I? Yeah. Why? Because you, you're bringing your clutch up too, too fast. Why would I do that? Because I've not prompted you. <laughs> okay. You haven't done anything, have you? I've not said anything yet. You're no. expecting me to get it right. And there's yeah. not a chance. There's no. not a chance on this earth no. I'm ever going to get that right without a prompt. Right, okay. So The only chance you've got of me getting it right is if you've taught me through it, you've prompted me, and then you say, yeah. try that on your own. Yeah. If you miss that bit out, yeah. I'm back to square one. All right, then. And okay. it's not realistic. And, yeah. That's not how humans behave. I know what to say. I know okay. what to say. Reset. Then, back in room. Reset. So, put your clutch down. Let's try that for ourselves. Select first gear. Make mm -hmm. sure you do your observations. Oh, yeah, All right. Yeah. Now, do you remember what I said about listening for the biting point? Oh, yeah. It was It was just... It was there, wasn't it? Is that right? Yeah, it was about there. It wasn't straining. No. It, yeah, that's right, yeah. Oh. So, have a look around. Do your observations. That's it. Now take your handbrake off. Now it's fine that we've not moved because mm -hmm. we're still in control, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so if you gently lift up your clutch, right, that's too much. That's, no, that's too much. You're doing it better. No, that's a little bit too fast. No, you're too fast now. Right, just slow down. Okay. And brakes then. So, what is it you're doing at the minute? Tell oh, me. I, I'm, I feel like I'm telling you again and I'm you supposed are. to be. Prompting. Prompting you. But then you, it was getting out of control. Because you're not doing what you've said you'll do. Right. So I'm responding in a way that's going to mess you up. So I need to shut up better. <laughs> Remember, you've taught me through it. You've made mm -hmm. it happen. Yeah. You're now trying to transfer some responsibility to me, but you're going to prompt me. Right. So remember how much clutch you need to use. Yeah. It isn't much, is it? Remember how much or just that much? So when you, you said that to me, I remember what we're looking for. Oh, it's about that. You've prompted me. I did it bang on. Yeah. Yeah. You then left me to my own devices and I messed it up. Yeah. So what do I do then? What's the difference between so, leaving you and prompting so, you? <laughs> so you? Before you told me, so this time you'd say, okay, so we want to move the car slowly. So how much clutch are you going to bring up? Yeah. Well, only a little bit. Let's try that and see then. Yeah. Is that about right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Is that moving the right speed? How it is? Oh, it's a bit quick. What can you do about that? I'll push it down a bit. That's the prompt. Right. Or remember, we're only going to make little movements. And right. then let me do it. But you're giving me the prompt. Right. Whatever it happens to be, you need to lead in with that. Right. Then I'll so respond I guess properly. My instruction that I've given you. First time, bang on. You've made me do it. You've, you've got yeah. the ring through me nose and you're guiding yeah. me along. Do it. So this is more about memory prompting, isn't it? It's Correct. more about remembering what I've said. Is it? I think so, yeah. <laughs> so I've got to remember what I've said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But so. remember, you just you know what the problem is. The movements were too big. Yeah. That was what was causing you the issue, wasn't yes. it? Yes, yeah. You've cured that when you've taught me through it. Yeah. So the prompt needs to be. Yeah, but I've not actually really thought that's what the problem is. Although I've cured it, I've seen you do it. So mm -hmm. I've kind of cured it as it's happened. Mm -hmm. I've not made a mental note to think he's going to do this again. So I need to make a mental note to think, right, I need to remember to say small movements. That's exactly. It. So <laughs> on the, the talk through, you've made me do it. You know what you've had to do to correct it. That's the bit you're going to have to prompt me on. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's Sounds the complicated. Intricate. It's, uh, it's intricate. It's, it's, it's just, it's just, it's a very simple thing. Mm. 
but we can easily overcomplicate it mm. if we're not if we're not really focusing on what it is. What do we need to do here? Mm. What is it I need to do? Mm. And they got so you've yep. talked me through it. Yep. We've stopped. Right. So let's give that another go. Okay. okay. Now remember what we talked about with the with the um, engine tone and oh, yeah. the feeling of the bite and getting it getting it right. And then remember, we control the speed with very very fine smooth movements, paper thin. So it's all about where the clutch is. So do your observations. That's it. Okay, so that's too fast. So remember clutch. Remember. <laughs> I thought I reminded you that time. Did you? <laughs> what did you say to me? What's the simple way you can do that? Let me, let me do you in a dual control. Okay, so what I'd like you to do is we're going to mm -hmm. bring it to the bike where we're holding it still like you did before. Yeah. Don't, don't move anything. Yeah. That's it. Brilliant. Now then, what we're going to do in a second is we're going to move the, for, the car forward very slowly. Right. So remember it's not a lot of clutch. Yeah. Or how much clutch you're going to use. Either one of those. Yeah. But the clutch is the issue. You see, you were a little bit vague, so I just shot off. Mm. So that's it. Remember that we don't need too much. How's that? Oh, well, it's a little bit quick, so what can you do? Oh, push the clutch down a bit. That's, that's it. Brilliant. That's it there. That's it. Excellent. Well done. Mm. Then again, we're still in that mode we're talking mm. through, so again, I'll prompt you going backwards. Mm -hmm. So get it to the bite first and hold it still. That's right. Do your observations. So we're looking backwards. We'll wait for these to come past. Mm. You know, just then, when we went forward, and because you lifted your clutch up a little bit too fast to demonstrate that that, oh, that's a little bit fast. What do you do? Put your clutch back down again. I was conscious that we were running out of room. What happens on the exam if that happens? Stop. Right. So just right, just stop now and then put it into reverse. I'm not going to cause you an issue with that. No. But Otherwise, but, I'm dragging you off topic. Yeah. <laughs> so this time, so we've done that. Do our observations. So we're at the bite. Now remember what we talked about before about clutch movement. Yeah. How is that working? Mm -hmm. That's all right. That's a bit quick. So what do you need to do? I'll just push it down a bit. That's better. So again, thinking about controlling it. How's that for speed? That's all right. That's it's still a little bit quick. What do you need to do? I'll just push it down a little bit. How's that? I feel something. That's still a little bit too quick. So just think about it. What do you need to do? I'll just push it down a little bit. That's it. Brilliant. Now see if you can maintain it that way. How much clutch movement did we say we needed? Oh, not too much. So well, maybe, maybe we are using a little bit too much. So just have a think about that. How much are you going to use here? Oh, just a little bit there. How much did we say? How did we describe that? Oh, I can't remember. Just the thickness of a piece of paper, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, can we feel that little lumpy stuff there? Oh, yeah. What did we say that was? Oh, you said I was moving too much. So mm. you're in. You're all over me all the time. You're not letting it happen. Mm. Now I'll take us back a little bit. So the next stage would be, mm. okay, how do you feel about having to go on that on your own? Mm. Taking it forward and stopping and back and stopping. Yeah, I think I'm alright. Do you need mm. any help from me? No, no, I can manage that. Mm -hmm. Okay. And yeah, bring it to stop. That's fantastic, well done. Mm. That's it, you're done. Yeah. But we need to just see those three stages yeah. and, and in and work hard quickly. Well, not yeah. work hard, work smart. Yeah. Think what do I need to do here? And in between each thing, okay, just wait there. Think to yourself, where am I at? Now? Your form on there with a little tick box will help you. Right, I'm prompting now. Yeah. What do I need to prompt? Yeah. Size of movement on the clutch. So if we're at prompting stage now, mm -hmm. did we do the analysis bit and the dangers? You've told me. Oh, we did. We did that on. Yeah. Did we do that on the brief? If if you if you go coming up with the clutch too quick, you're going to run out of time. Yeah. Oh, right, okay. And yeah, I did mention it. that, didn't I? Mm -hmm. this mum wants to get in? He does. Uh, I'll take it back a little. And we could have got round us there. No, it's, it's alright, he's following us. I don't know which drive he wants. <laughs> he oh, could have okay. easily gone round oh, us no. there. Bah, there you go. That's the way it is. He must get fed up of it if they use this area a lot for turning the road. Well, they do. <coughs> right. by the way. And the other thing is, I have noticed that each time I've had to remind you about your, your observations, I've had to remind you to do your, um, 
Why would that be? Because it's part of the thing. So I. But it's also. I need to do my things on that. Yeah, well, you're working on clutch control now. I would, I would get an attempt in at the, at the turn of the road right. fairly quickly now. Yeah. Because um, <laughs> it's like tomorrow. <laughs> but I mean, it's fine. We're breaking it into its little component parts. We said yeah, that at the start, which is what so I wanted okay. to do, yeah. It's going to take some so mastering this. No, not at all, really. It's just, it's about, when you look back at the video, you'll see it's just. Yeah. I you just need I... to be stopping and thinking, what do I need to do here? I'm going to pull us up here because we'll wait for him. So it looks like that's somebody on that part three, I think. Oh, really? Oh, um, I don't know how it goes out to them. Actually, no, it can't be. What day is it? <sighs> no, they're not on part three. Part yeah. three's are on a Monday here, so we're all right. So let's have a look see how they do. So, we've driven here, you've spotted that there's some clutch, some observation, and some steering and stuff. Mm -hmm. I've just displayed across the observation, it's poor, because I keep, if you hadn't reminded me, I keep forgetting to do my yeah. blind spot. But I've been reminding each you time, have. That's I've fine. been alright. That's fine. But I've, I, I, that reminding, well, I, I'm not there. Then you, you're not, so you need, we need to iron it out. Mm. But at the minute, you're just sorting the clutch control out so you can have mm. an attempt at the turn of the road. Yeah. Now, you could just have an attempt at the turn of the road. The clutch control problem would become an issue straight away. You just stop, mm. just take us back to the side of the road here. In a way, I'd rather get the clutch control ironed out first because it's something off my mind then. Yeah, I mean, it's a, a good thing to do, but you've just got to be really careful that you don't spend so much time on it, you don't get to do any turn of the mm. road. Um, so if you go down that path, it needs it needs to happen really quick, mm. so that we're we're in and 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 fixing the thing immediately. Mm. Okay. So there's nothing to stop you, you know, doing that initial attempt. Yeah. If the clutch control is too quick, you probably know it's going to be just stop. Oh, this is a bit of an issue for us here. Mm. But the way we've done it there now, we fixed that. Mm. So the clutch control is not going to be an issue for you. No. But you know that the observation and the steering is. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, at what point now, I've, I've, I've obviously, I've made note that your observations were a bit pants when you were doing your up and down this. So, do I bring that up before we start the... Absolutely. Right, yeah, I thought so. <laughs> so, should I go back into room? Okay. So... I noticed when we were, we've had a bit of a practice now, haven't mm -hmm, we, with mm -hmm. clutch control, you're yeah. feeling a lot better about that. Mm -hmm. You were doing a lot better in the end. Yeah. Okay. What I did notice when we were doing that? No. All right. Careful you don't take yourself down the same path again All and right. not get an attempt at the turn of the road. Okay. All right. Otherwise you're going to run out of time. All right. Yes, it's great if you can do that, but I'm just sensing yeah. that there's a danger here. I'm running out of time. Yeah. Right. You would have run out of time then. Yeah. Um, so fix it on the go. All right. Okay. All um, right. Otherwise, you're going to be talking about observations. You're not going to get a single attempt in the right. Okay. He's not going to be happy with that. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's 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 attempt the turn in the road. Oh, turn in the road. Doggy. Okay. So we're going to do our turn in the road. Okay. You remember? You may you'll remember some of what we've talked about. Don't worry. Well, I'm I know. <laughs> some of. Says right. who? <laughs> okay. You might remember some of what we've talked about, but either way, it doesn't matter. I'm here. I'll All talk right. you through it. All right, okay. And um, we'll have it. We'll give it a go. Oh, okay. All right. So prepare the car in the normal way. Okay. So find your biting point. Remember what we discussed about finding it, so that you've got control. Yeah. Is that it there? Yep. Brilliant. Okay. So now, what you need to do is your observations. So can you remember? Oh, you can't. I'm not going to say remember. Just check this window here. Yeah. Check around the car. Check through this. We're checking to see if there's someone there. All okay. Right. A, a cyclist might come up, not realising what we're wanting to do. So have a look round, around the whole car, around the front, around this side, and check your blind spot. Now, what can you see in your blind spot? Yeah. We've talked right about. Right there, yeah. Yeah, the hedge and the, the house. Yeah. Okay. Right. So, when you're content, it's a hundred percent free of anybody. You're mm -hmm. not going to knock anyone over. Yeah then start your manoeuvre. So remember clutch control. Now you want big steers to the right. Big. No, that's too small. Big steers. Right round. Right round. That's better. Now stop there. Stop there. Right. Well done. You did all right, but you were still going too fast. All right, but we'll all have right. another go. I tried the thing when the clutch didn't work. Right, now just have a look 
thing we see far away. Um, just out of roll for a minute. Okay. Don't oh, worry about it. <laughs> your reference points, to, you, you're too far over. Okay. Um, so, oh, I don't know. So I'm going to have to get you to stay the other way, aren't I? Okay. But you're probably going to mount the curve. Well, no, you might not. Right, you might not. So I wouldn't stopped. go any further forward than no. this. No. No, go backwards then. Backwards now. All right then. So put the car into reverse. Okay. So have your hand on the handbrake. Do your observations this way, that way. And the last place you're going, have a look. Check your blind spots. And then gently using that control again, yeah. go backwards. Big steers, big steers. Too fast, too fast, but you clutch down and press your brake. Okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Minor detail. <laughs> Minor detail. <what>? Major detail. <laughs> right. I did as you told me. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> right, let's start again. <laughs> okay. It's very easy to get yourself bogged down and stuff. Now, why did why did what happened happen? We were going too fast. Why would that happen when you just fixed me clutch control? Because I didn't prompt you. No, no, clutch control was fine. Oh, I did prompt you. What was the issue? Well, you, you steered too small, mm -hmm. so you didn't get this full steering on. Because you got at me then. I, I started the... You did start in the end. Yeah, but then I ran out of time. Yeah. What did I need to do that I didn't? Well, you break <laughs> right because I just let it roll down the hill yeah I tried to slow it down you did I pushed the clutch down you did oh I said you I tried that clutch thing it didn't work yeah yeah break 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 oh we're running downhill when here, do I so start saying break? break halfway across the road you just just need to be aware of it oh, as soon as you set off <laughs> oh, yeah. so remember as we're coming to the other side of the road we're going to pick up speed so you might need to push the clutch down and use the brake but you can just say clutch down brake Touchdown break. That's it. See, we're running downhill now. Mm. So, so the stuff you fixed. Is, this is why this one's such mm. a a hard one. It can be. Yeah. It can be. I can dance you around all over the place. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Right. Okay. So, are we a bit far away for starting? Oh, no, I'll take us forward in a second. All right. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Bus was coming on a little curve. I'll take us forward again. Okay. And then of course I've come back here because you said steer. Right? <laughs> you didn't say steer the other way. No. Okay, another okay. go? Another go. Okay. Right. So I'm getting all discombobulated now. Right. <laughs> you like that word. word. <laughs> okay, so first gear, prepare to move off, as we did before. Okay, it's very that's it. Now make sure you do your observations right round the car. Okay, it's very important we do those. We don't want to knock anyone over, do we? No, no. Okay, that's right. When you've checked your blind spot, gently move off, remembering to go nice and slow. Steer big, steer. Big steers to the right. Big steers to the right. Big steers to the right. I'll just wait there. <laughs> so you need to be aware too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, pick up where you left off. Right. Big steers to the right. Not big, they're small. Oh, right, slow down, brake, brake, brake. Right. Okay, now we're a bit, we can go a little bit further across, but I'm glad we've stopped us because it'll slow us down. Oh. Well, it will, it'll stop us. So just gently move off again using the control that we talked about and be prepared to brake, cover your brake. What so should I do? Big, about him? Yeah, move forward. What about him? Oh, right. Um, just let him go. Is there a room? Oh, right. No, he's not going to. Oh, well, what do I do now? I'm back I'll take up. us back. <laughs> so we need to be alert to what's around us. Take command of the situation like that. Either carry on uh, yeah. or not. You're too far over uh, for him to go around the front of you, so you need yeah, to get the car forward, yeah. wave him around the back of you. Yeah, yeah. Breathe. 
So there's a lot to do in a very it, short space of time. There is. And it can Surrender. be a nightmare if you allow it to happen. So just allow yourself to break, you said before, that yeah. bought you a ton of time then. Right, this is yeah. where we do our observations. And that's when everyone arrives. And <laughs> wants always. To drive fast. <laughs> always. Yeah. Um, if we'd given them another moment or two, we'd have driven in that nearby and gone round. Yeah. But it gives you the time then. Now then, do all your observations. It gives you time to just go. Right, now we need to slowly move the car forward. Uh, it's going to pick up a little bit. So before the car moves again, yeah. prevent what's about to happen. Yeah. So you yeah, know, we're going to move forward here. It's going to start running away. So at that point, the clutch will come down and we'll gently brake. Before we get to the curb, mm. we want to change the steering to the other direction. So you've yeah. got the time to do that yeah. while you've stopped yeah. the car. Yeah. This is why the stop in the middle is vital. Yeah. Now that stop in the middle, I felt it was probably not, it was too soon, was it? Doesn't matter. You're, you're nearly halfway. Right. So would that have been adequate enough to start steering the other way and still get round? Well, you can we talk backwards? about, you know, as we get close to the curb, we need to start steering the other way. Because yeah. if you try and talk them through it in that short space of time, you're probably not going to have the time. So I'll talk about that when you've done the stop no. in the middle. What about when I do the stop in the middle, do I get them to look at the first reference point and say, this is your first reference point for this side? You can. When you get to this point, start to steer the other way. You can, but you might not need a reference point. No. Okay. No. That makes sense. Yeah. You may, you may not. Yeah. Is it is it good to refer foot to one anyway? Just well, yeah, it, it, it can't hurt as long yeah. as you're not you know adding stuff in that's that's going to cause you complications. Yeah. But no, that's fine. Okay, all right. Are we ready again? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to have a good look to see who's arriving. <laughs> Every time they can hurry. Every time. As soon as you come, there's been nobody for ages. As soon as we come to do it, yeah. look what happens. <laughs> it's just the way it works. They do it here on L test as well. Do they? It's tough. It's a tough location. Oh, so not only have you brought me and done the toughest one, we've had the toughest location. <laughs> well, this is where they do it. This is where they do it. <laughs> oh, it is a bit of a tricky one, isn't it? Because it's it on is. a bend as well. It is. And it's on a slight slope. Okay, so prepare to move the car. Find your bike like we talked about so that you'll move off gently, slowly. All right. Do your observations. Okay, remember they're very important. Mm -hmm. And then now gently start to move with big steers to the right. Big steers. Now don't cross your hands over. Ten to two, big steers. Right, stop there, brake, brake, stop. Right, okay. Now around this position you want to start steering in the other direction. So anti-clockwise. Right. Now do your observations again because you've stopped. Things could have changed. Right. Okay, so gently start again, covering your brake in case you need to stop. So cover your brake, that's it. Gently move, gently clutch up, clutch up. Right, cover your brake. Stay the other way, stay the other way. Right, stop, stop. Okay, now how do you feel? Right, just stop there for a moment. I'm going to let this car come behind me if it's going to move. going to wait. What do I do? What do I do? All right. Okay, so put the car into reverse. Let's go for it. Okay, so I want you to steer in that direction again. So find your bike. Find your, all right, not too quick. Remember, take your handbrake off. Do your observations. That's it. Okay, so gently. That's it. Now big steers to the right. Big steers to the right. To the left. To the left. That's it. Gently. Cover your brake. Cover your brake. Cover your brake. Okay, stop around there. Right, look each way. Do your observations. Right, now carry on. Big stairs now to the right. To the right. To the right. Okay, stop there. Stop there. That's it. Well done. So, select first gear. Okay, now find your biting point. That's it. Handbrake on. Find your biting point. That's it. Gently take your handbrake off. That's it. And that's it. You're moving very well. Steer big to the right. Big to the right. Okay, well done. And then just pull up somewhere on the left. Sorry, I didn't say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Oh, Jesus. Everyone's gone. <laughs> 
Did we buckle under the pressure? No, no, you didn't. <laughs> and it, it's important that you don't, that you, no. you remain calm and just say, okay, yeah. what do I need to do here? Yeah. You attempted to get him to come past. Could you have waved him around? It was arguable because there wasn't a very big gap, was there? No, so I think I think you've made the best of a bad job. Yeah. Um, but the most important <laughs> thing is to not let it flap you. Yeah. Um, so how was it, that first attempt? Um, of course that's the first attempt, as far as not including the other attempts. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, it was fairly controlled. Mm -hmm. Why was it controlled? Because we mastered the speed. Mm -hmm. So you're, you're saying we. Tell me about this we thing. <laughs> they always say that, don't they? Oh, which is good. Um, well... What was what was my part in what we did there? What I did thought I you were quite lenient on me, to be honest. You could have played worse, I thought. <laughs> well, you've already sorted the control of the speed out. Yeah. So, I've attempted to not do some observations. Um, and I've attempted to get the steering wrong. Yeah, I think I forgot to remind you to observe before you set off for the last mm -hmm. time. Okay, that's fine. So, there's still a work in progress, aren't there? That still needs some yes. doing. But our control of speed is okay. Yeah. Uh, you've got in with a stop command and made me stop a couple of times. It's fine. Yeah. That's good. Now you bought yourself time. Yeah. But while you're in that, make sure you're happy with where you're at and what you're going to do. You didn't let the other traffic rush you. You did a little bit at the end. Yeah. Stay calm. Yeah. Just think, what do I need to do here? Because yeah. your, your speed of speech picked up a little bit there. That yeah. tells me that you're starting to get a bit... <laughs> yeah. yeah. But not bad. Yeah. I did what you told me to do. Yeah. My yeah. observations were poor, weren't they? Coming yeah. backwards. Yes. I You're was probably... looking forwards. Yeah. Oh, but you yeah. gave me the opportunity because uh, you were staring at this car. Yes. Yeah. But that's okay. Yeah. It's something you can work on now. Yes. So now you've got your core comps on your obs. Yeah. And, and the, yeah. the, 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 the So now I can sit down with you now and talk about your observations, can't I? With a car sat still. Yes. <laughs> now, Bob. Right. <laughs> Let's discuss these observations. Right. Okay, now I did notice that, well, throughout everything we've done today, I've had to remind you about your observations. Oh, right, right. All right. Okay. Now, why, why... <coughs> right, here you go, here's a question out of roll. What's How's best to approach this? Do I talk about why first? Because it says why on the list first, so I tend to lean towards it that way. But am I? Can I discuss the dangers of it What's as the part of the analysis? Of each, what's the merits of each approach? Well, so if you went for the why first, what well, does that the reason give you? you want to know why is because you can't fix it unless you know the reason. Okay. So what would you gain by doing the dangers first? Well, you might just gain fixing it. Okay. If you can... So what does your gut tell you about which way you should go? If you were left to sort of... You had to make a choice, which way would you lean? Dangers. Okay, well, let's try that and see what happens. Right. Okay. Okay, so... Do you realise how important it is to do your observations? No. no. It's important dish, I suppose. Yeah. Okay, what would happen, just just replay in your mind, you're doing that manoeuvre there, mm -hmm. and you didn't look, and a child ran out, mm. and you crashed into him. I don't think I'd like that. You wouldn't, would you? No, no, no I think so, no. But that's how important it is. That's how dangerous not doing your right. observations is. Right, well, I hadn't thought of that. Right. Oh, okay, yeah, right. So, was that good? <laughs> was that try okay? It, try it the other way. All right. So the other way is, um, why aren't you doing your observations? Just can't be asked. No. <laughs> well, well, that's on me. <laughs> oh my God. I thought I was. I, I did look around. Yeah. Right. Okay. You might have thought that you, what you did was adequate. Yeah, I did. Yeah, yeah. Can you for sure say that you could see all the way around the car? Yeah, I was fairly sure. Well, <laughs> oh no, out of roll, I don't know what to say to that. Try again. Alright. <laughs> I've forgotten what I've said. 
Um, so I think I've done enough observations. Yeah, you think you've done enough observations and you've clearly not. Um, so then I start to lean towards, but what if someone came out? Right. Again. So. So I'm going back to the dangers again. Well, is that okay? I suppose so. Try it and see. Okay. So you think you've done adequate yeah, observations? I've looked quite a lot. Okay. Well, you didn't. Oh. Okay. See, I can't give... Where are all these people when you need them on oh. our last lesson? <laughs> I can't give you any examples. That's what I'm looking for. Make one up. So, like I said before, if a child came out and you hit them... There you go. Because children are only small. And they learn at around the age of two to get out of the door <laughs> unaccompanied. Right. And they could run out onto the road. Oh, right. And unless you've seen all around the car before you move it, you can't be content that you're not going to knock somebody over. Oh, right. Right. Have you thought about that? I haven't, no. no. Mm. So either way, you'll end up the same way. Yeah. So, but am I. So have a little think for a moment. Does it matter which way around you do those? No, I don't suppose so. As long as you get the end result. Yeah. You're tackling both, aren't you? But I don't really know how to combat. If you think you've done enough observations, how do I convince you you've not? I've, I can tell you till I'm blue in the face that uh, it's do dangerous. You want to swap roles for a second? Yeah. Okay. You put your, yourself in the position you can't be asked or you think you've done enough. Mm. So would you have said that the, the observations that you took there were sufficient? Okay, so you've checked around enough to keep yourself safe? Yeah, yeah, I think so, yeah. Would you say you've done enough to keep everybody around you safe? Well, they will keep themselves safe, won't they? Well, some people can, some people can't. What sort of place are we in here? It's a residential area, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, what sort of housing is it? How many bedrooms do you think these houses have? Oh, yeah, I see what you're saying. Well, families, families live in there, isn't it? Mm. So families have what? Children? Yeah. yeah. So it's reasonable to expect perhaps a child who was 14, 15 to look after themselves. What about a two or a three year old that may have escaped? Yeah. Are you sure there was none of them around? They're kind of small, aren't they? Mm. Like could you guarantee there was nobody there? How could you guarantee there was nobody there? Stopping the car and physically getting out and walking around. We could. <laughs> but that's but we not practical, is it? It isn't. So what would be the practical thing you could do? Just use everything that we've got to see properly. Right. So we're not... <laughs> For goodness sake. <laughs> I keep turning this off and it keeps... <laughs> it's determined, though. <laughs> So I'm making the point. I've got yeah. to be dangerous, but you can say, are you 100% certain there was nobody around? around? Mm. Mm. Well, how, you know, have a look at the driveways here. A kiddie could come running out of here. Mm. You know, look at the time. It's coming up to kicking out time at school, isn't it? Mm. There might be some small ones. So we need to make 100% certain, and that's looking through every window mm. um, of our boss shoulders. Mm. All right. So you can make the case. Yeah. So that's so, enough, is it? That, yeah. That, that, if so you don't think it's enough, it's not enough. Yeah. I'm not 100% convinced you were 100% sure, because mm. I certainly wasn't. I need to see you check around more than that. Yeah. And then yeah. we go right on cue, there's the buses going to the school. <laughs> yeah. So we've now, we've, so remedial. How does that look? With the stirring, with the, with the observations. Mm -hmm. Well, we've talked about the dangers. So you've got me on board. Yeah. We're now in, what's the plan then? Right, so the plan is, we've got to do it again. Mm -hmm. I've got to talk you through your observations. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping by now the control thing... That's fixed. Right, That's okay. not going to rear its head again. You see, that's the thing, I've got it in my head that that might come back again. Mm. There's an element of it that might. Yes. But my clutch control is fixed. Yeah. It's when we run away down the hill to yeah. the other side. Yeah. That I haven't quite got right. And also the steering, we've not we've not discussed so you would the tackle steering. All of that while he was at it. Yeah. So obs we've 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 you know, we've put a little star yeah. next to that and we've talked about it. You're gonna talk me through now. Now you've got to get me on board with the steering. Yeah. It's difficult to do that when you're still sat still, isn't it? 
you can still make a kiss. Right, okay. Well, have a go. Yeah. Right, okay. Um, so, did you notice when we started off, you weren't quite getting the car round? Did you notice that you were doing lots of little little movements with the steering wheel? I didn't know, no. Well, you were. All right. You were doing little movements like this. Right. Okay. Now, it's very important to get the car right round in as um, as less turns as possible. Right. Now to do that, you have to steer hard. Mm. Right. Not well, not hard, but make big movements with your steering wheel because you right. need. What's the term I'm looking for? Sorry, out of roll. Big movements with the steering wheel is fine. That's, that's is all that right. all right? Yeah, that's all right. Because you you want it to steer. Yeah. You want the steering on as quick as you can. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Steering on. A valid point. It's hard a term to use. Hard steering. It's a, it's not loose. really descriptive, is it? No. So you want the steering on as fast as you can. So really, when you're moving the mm. steering, make your hands touch at the top and the bottom, so you're getting the maximum amount of steering on in the shortest possible time. Okay. And in that way, that'll help you get round. Another way you could have tackled it was said. So did we make the last one round in three? Well, we did, but we only just made it, didn't we? Yeah. Oh yeah. If you'd been harder with the steering, you'd have had plenty of room. Right. And it wouldn't have been a bit tight at the end. So okay. we need to really work that steering hard. So when we are steering, we need to use it to its fullest effect. Yeah, right, fullest okay. effect. I like that. Yeah. All right, that yeah, okay, okay, yeah. Okay. Can you see how that would get you around quicker? Oh yeah, I see what you're on about now. Now yeah. I'm on board. Yeah. Okay. But I'm still going to need to be reminded. Yes. So oh, yeah. you've Come done the fault. Yeah. After you've spotted the fault, you've made me aware of it on yeah. the steering and the observations. Mm. You've got me on board with both of them, mm. and your plan now is to what? <laughs> Do a run through. Mm -hmm. And from the uh, are we on the prompting stage? Are we? Well, we are for possibly the the rolling down of the hill of the camber with the brake. Are we? I don't know. <laughs> Have we talked about it, really? No, not really, no. So not at all. That's going to stay exactly the way it was. Right, okay. Unless you do something about it. And you've got the option to do that now. So, you'd have so that we've third still one. got a little issue here with the clutch. Coasting. We're... So you want me to coast, in effect, really. Yes. But the problem is, on the other side of the camber. Yeah. I've got an issue with the camber, haven't I? I'm not understanding that. I can control it going up, because my clutch control is great. I said to you, I tried the clutch thing, it didn't work. All right, yeah, so cover the brake. So I don't understand what's going on there. Yeah, okay, so we've got to cover the brake going down. So you need to tell me that you spotted that fault, you need to analyse it, get me on board, and then you need to talk me through that. Okay, all This right. is why this is a difficult exercise. Yes. <laughs> okay, so I did notice, so we've talked about the steering already. I did notice, that, no, yeah. we're not, we talked about the observations. That mm -hmm. was, that one, we've ironed that one. On board with that, kind yeah. Of. Yeah, okay. I believe you now. You believe me now, okay. So... The other thing I did notice was the steering. You were making small movements and you yeah. weren't really convincingly yeah, yeah. getting the car around. Yeah, you have to, yeah, so okay. I can see that so now, yeah. Make your hands touch at the top and bottom when yeah. you're using your, your pull push method. Okay. Get yeah. that steering right on and then yeah. that way you'll get the car around. Get around quick. easy, you said. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we'll we'll watch you do that. Alright. And I might have to remind you. All right, and then the other side of it was when we were we rolled down the hill slightly, didn't we? And I had to stop yeah. you quite suddenly, didn't yeah, I? Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fine. I tried slowing it down. Yeah, you were right to use the clutch, but because we're going because we're on a camber look, we're actually rolling down hills. So the best way is you might just need to so the amount of speed you pick up on this side with your clutch. Mm. Once you've got to this point, it'll start to roll down. Oh, you did feel so, like it ran away. Yeah, so cover your brake. So once right. you've gone over, can you see roughly where the middle of the road is? I know there's no markings on this well, it's road. It's like a join, isn't it? There is, yeah. So if you use that, perhaps as your benchmark for going over the camber, oh, right. start to cover your brake. So once you're on this side, that side of the road, that's when you want to start covering your brake. Right, right. Okay. There is a balance of getting it right. Oh, okay. And it does require practice. Okay. But, but I'll, I'll talk you through it as best as I can. Okay. Okay. So remember your observations. Remember your steering, and then I'll, we'll talk through the, the clutch control and the steering. Okay. okay. So tell me what you think I'm going to do now. What's your plan first? Tell me what you're going to do. Right. My plan is to ask you to do it again. Mm -hmm. Still remind you about your observations, or maybe I should sit back and see if you do it yourself. Okay. Because we've ironed this out now. Are so. We? 
<laughs> well, I don't know. <laughs> Go back to your fault sheet. Um, well, I've, I've not. I've not. I'm just right over the top of the one that you've got. Right. So where, where's where's that one? Lost in the it's very easy to lose track mist of, of stuff. where you're at with the, with the various bits and pieces. Mm -hmm. Just write. Just use these ones you've already written on, but do them in red. So you've got. There we go. Let, let me let me let me let me ask you some questions here. Mm. So it's obs, steering, and camber. So you've spotted the fault on all of those. Mm -hmm. Have you told me about those? Um, yes. Have we discussed the reasons why, or the dangers? Have you got me on board that I know that I need to do it? Yeah, we, okay. we have with the obs. We've not and the camber, on this. you've just told me, look, it's going to run away with it. That's yeah. enough. I'll go, all right, okay. Yeah. I'm buying it. Okay. So what's the plan? Right, so the plan, we need a plan. I'm going to have another attempt, but what yeah. are you going to do? Talk you through it. Talk you through all of it, actually. Okay, you were just setting yourself up to remind me. Yeah, you? yeah. What would have happened if you'd reminded me? You, you wouldn't have done it. No. Right. So. So this is why this is important. Yeah. I'd have just. I went, what? Oh, oh, cack. Oh, I've got it wrong again. Mm. Oh. Mm. So you need to talk me through it, then prompt, right. then fix. Chances are, you only get the chance to do a full talk through. Because mm. you're going to run out of time, but it doesn't matter, you're still on the right track. You if know, you leave me to my own devices here, it's going to go wrong. So, you know when I just said to you then about the big steers and touching your hands at each no, hand, is that talk, not adequate not for a talk through? No. No. You, you okay. taught me through doing it. Doing it. Right. Remember, okay. uh, you're trying to form habits. This mm. is the way the DVSAC. You're trying to form habits in my driving. To form habits, I have to do it right. Mm. I'm only going to do it right if you make me do it right. Mm because I've done it a different way. That's the habit I've formed. Mm -hmm. So you make me do it right twice, yeah. then you can prompt me, then you can hand it to me. Now I have formed a new habit. Right. But okay. without your input at the start, that full talk through, it's never gonna happen. Right. I might make a teeny tiny improvement, um, but what you're doing is you're allowing yourself to be dragged down the, the, the normal human behavior path. If you'd mm. had that conversation with a learner driver, it would be fixed by now. Mm. But I, the same guy ain't got it. You must follow this pattern. Okay. Otherwise, you're just going to dance all over the place. Right. So some great stuff. Mm. You need to package it different. That's all. Yeah. This will help you package it right. Okay. So we're on full talk through now. They're all at the same stage, aren't they? They are. Because that are. last time I, we were a bit further up with one and not the other, so mm -hmm. I found that a little bit confusing. Okay. And I think that's where I'm struggling with a little bit today. <coughs> okay. Understanding where we are at different. I think this is why I like this so much because. Yeah. If you're stopping and you're thinking, where am I? You can look at the form and see where you're at. Yeah. The ones you've ticked, you know you've done. Yeah. If you've not put this there, so your fix is, but well, what I'm going to do is, mm. I'm going to talk you through those. Mm. So you've got the chance to talk me through my observations before the car moves. Mm. You've got the chance to talk to me about the steering as I'm doing it. Mm. You're going to stop me at the top. Mm. Observations again, which you can talk me through. And then as we move off, you're going to talk me through a clutch down brake. Mm. That's it, well done. <laughs> so you're sorted then. Mm. And then you can talk me through the observation. Well, you know, just before we move away, because the, the observations happen when the car's still. Mm. So you are breaking it down into little lumps, mm. but you're working really smart at the bit that you're working on at that point. You're not mm. thinking about the whole thing in the, in, in the round, if you like. Mm. <coughs> Does that make sense? Yes. So the plan is we're going to. It's quite all right for me to actually verbally say this to is the, the examiner. Plan. <laughs> the plan is, yeah. So uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to we, we'll have a plan for this because <laughs> they're all key words, aren't they? For yeah. the examiner. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay, so we'll have a plan. Okay. What we'll do is we'll do that. We'll do it again. Mm -hmm. Turning the road again. Okay. I'll talk you through it right. at every stage. Okay. Covering these these things your mm -hmm. observations your steering mm -hmm. all right and we'll talk about the camber and covering the brake because you said it ran away with you a little bit last time Did a bit, yeah, yeah yeah okay so are you ready yeah okay we're all steamed up that's it aren't we? <laughs> okay just give it a second Okay, so prepare the car. Remember about the clutch. Now yeah. remember your observations. Now can you see anyone 
around the car, have a look. Is there anybody there on the footpath? Uh, no. Uh, no. Right, stop. Stop right there. I'm not content that you've looked around this car properly. Alright. You've just done a little bit of a look. You need to look. I'll tell you what, what can you see in that mirror? There's a bin. Right. What can you see over there? Through that window? The driveway? Yeah, so oh, how do yeah. you know someone's not going to run no, out on that? No. Right. Okay. Charles just got out of that house. Right. Can you see him? No, because you didn't look. Oh, right. Okay. okay. Yeah. Mirror, is there anyone walking down the footpath? No. All around. Right. And then look out that side and yeah. do your blind spot. How do you know someone's not trying to cross oh, behind right. the car? Oh, I suppose, yeah. Okay. Okay, so remember in your clutch control. Handbrake, it's off. Okay, it's off. It's okay, so just check your blind spot before you steer. Okay, right now, big steers to the right. Right, too fast, slow down, slow down. Big steers, big, big steers, that's it. Right, now just be prepared now to cover your brake, cover your brake. That's it. Now stop there, stop there, stop there. Right, now have a look out there at the curb. Where does it join the car? Because that can that's you. by the top of the yeah. mirror. Well, you try to remember that now, because that's roughly where you need to be before you start steering the other way. Oh, right. Okay. okay. So if you gently let the car roll, so take your foot off the brake, you might have to slightly lift your clutch up. Oh, well, let's roll right. a bit. Yep. Big steers now, to the right. To the left. To the left. To the left. That's it. Right. Stop there. Brake. 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 Okay. Now have a look now out the window. Yeah. And think about that for your second reference point. That's before you'll hit the kerb. It's just under the bottom of the window. That's the right. Mirror. Okay, so we've, we've got a car coming now, but don't panic. Put your handbrake on. Okay. Right, now do your all-around observations. Uh, yeah. Is there anyone can you see? Uh, yeah, right. there's nobody Put the about. car into reverse. Find your biting point again. That's it. Not too fast, remember. Put your foot down a little bit. That's it. Yeah, go on. Lift your clutch up slightly. Big stairs to the right. Big stairs to the right. Sorry, to the left. Yeah, to the left. Have a look out the back window. Where are you going? That's it. Right, just stop there for a moment. Cover your brake. Stop there. Okay, do your observations. Just look around. Okay, so look where the curb comes into the car. That's your second reference point. Your first reference point. Now start steering the other way. Start steering the other way. That's it. Right, stop there. Stop there. Okay, do your observations. Have a look around the car. That's it now. Car into it. Put your handbrake on. Have a look around the car. Do your blind spots. Car in first. Okay, so big steers to the right now. Big steers to the right. Well done. Now before you pull into the left, check your middle mirror and your left mirror. That's it. Now you didn't need to signal then. Oh. I wasn't sure about these people coming, so I thought maybe yeah. I better. Actually, you probably should have done it. Tell me about that. Oh, uh, I don't know. How did we go on? <laughs> No, you'll be able to check on the video when you come back. Uh -huh. Tell me how you think it went. It went okay. I did yeah. make you do your observations. Why did it go okay? Because we talked about these things. Because we were going slow. Yes, that was a help. Because I remembered everything. <laughs> <laughs> You made me do it. There was yeah. no room for me to go anywhere, was there? No. It was straight in, straight yeah. on me. Was I? Yeah. Oh, Stop! Oh, good. shit! <laughs> was I? <Yeah>. Good. <laughs> you were on it. Now, yeah. That's the way you need to work. Bang, yeah. bang, 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 bang. Yeah. Just straight in, making yeah. it happen. Bang. Yeah. Where before it was a bit, I was going to say airy fairy. That's not a nice way to describe no, it. No, it was. Just, it was just too gentle. You were just waiting for things to happen. Yeah. Don't let anything happen. Yeah. Because it will. Yeah. Where there, you were straight on me. Right, handbrake on, right? That's a car there. Don't panic. Sorry. Yep. Observations. Yeah. And of course, I'm going to try and move without yep. looking through the back. No, look through the back window. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I'll do what you tell answer. me to do. Yeah, I did. But you've got in and you've got in quick. Yeah. Also, straight, stop. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Now you've got time. So you've controlled the clutch. You know, we've fixed that first. So that yeah. buys you a bit of time, but you can still see there's still loads I can get wrong. Oh, I know. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> but if you work the way you just worked there, mm. I can't get it wrong because mm. I will respond to the commands you give me. Yeah. He will not ignore a command you give him. Yeah. Definitely will not ignore a command you give him. Right. So he might pull you at the end and go, you could do with maybe not being so stern. <laughs> 
done. If he says that to me, I will <laughs> die a death, I'm telling you, because that is one thing that I think I'm going to struggle with. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Uh-huh. You, you, you were in. You gave me the command. I yeah. stopped. That's that's exactly what you need to do. Mm. And it's a short burst of that high energy stuff that's required. <laughs> um, was that high energy? <laughs> it was. Well, if you re- if you yeah. come away yeah. from that, you're just giving them the opportunity to mess you about. Yeah. And um, I promise you, if you'd not done what you <laughs> should have done there, I would have I would have really messed it up. You told me the wrong way to stay on it. I did. On me immediately as I went for it. Because <laughs> yeah. I'm going to take that. No, 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 stop. stop the other way. Oh, right. No, left, left. Oh, okay. That's okay. It doesn't matter. You yeah, know? I've got it wrong. Oh, my God. But you're not being tested on your on your ability to tell the difference between left and right. <laughs> you then got quite cute about it and just said, stay the other way. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think I, took, I must have subconsciously took that on board. Because earlier on you said that. And I thought, yeah. That's good. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not saying one way or the other. Then I'm just saying the other way. I've already got to stay the other way. All right. Yeah. Okay. But if you got it wrong, it doesn't matter. You're um, straight in yeah. and fixing it. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. It's hard work, isn't it? Yeah. It's, so when, when you when you're taking it apart like this, and yeah. it, it can be heavy. Yeah. Um. And I I think this is the worst one. Yeah. Because there's so much I can do. Yeah. I can dance you around all over the place. Yeah. Um, but but if I can master this the rest i'll find slightly easier that last attempt just there if you can get in like that you're laughing right. it's easy um the thing to do is to every time you're driving the car now um talk yourself through stuff yeah um and just get on it yeah know? i've been doing that a little bit i've been trying to do you know what it, it sounds crazy but it feels like a world of difference being sat here and sat there because oh, yeah. You kind of you're doing things automatically there. Like what you were mentioning before with the clutch, I was making the assumption that because I was explaining to you about putting the clutch down, slowly bringing it up, and that resulting in a bit of movement, but I made the assumption that you would then understand that by pressing it would slow you back down again. But of course, I can't. That was the most my mistake. I didn't take it for granted. I took it for granted that you'd know that, mm. and I didn't think, oh, I'll have to explain that. Oh, no, assumptions but, can be uh, yeah. <laughs> really bad for you. Yeah. But no, it's, there's, there's a lot of a lot of good stuff in there. It's it's just really making sure, and this is the difficulty for part three, you've just got to show your best stuff in 28 minutes. Mm. So it's, you've got to turn up ready to go, mm. and hyped up and ready for the fight yeah. and this will help you to be just really zone in on it yeah because what this does it makes you much much more efficient mm. you're not wasting time that's the things you need to do you go through those nine steps everything will work mm. if you miss one out mm. you'll have you all over the place yeah. um, you know you nearly set yourself up to say well I'll remind you about that I yeah. thought should we shouldn't we <laughs> should I should I not and I thought, well, we're going to run a light soon. <laughs> so I don't want to waste time. I want to, I want to get to the point where it's right. So yeah. that's why I broke out a roll and just said, okay, have a think about this. Yeah. What would have happened was it went wrong. It would have gone wrong. At that point, you can stop and think, why has this gone wrong? You look back here and you think, oh, damn it. I should have been talking them through it. That's why it went wrong. Yeah. Okay. Obviously, that's not work. What I'm going to do now is the plan now is I'm going to talk you through this next one. Yeah. All right, okay. So you can go back a step. Of course you can. So Always a chance to recover. So where are we up to now then? So You tell we, me. We've done a to- full talk through. So now I'm going to ask you, how do you think that went? Yeah, it was all right, I think. Yeah. You I think it was okay. okay. Yeah. 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 Did you feel fairly confident? Yeah, yeah I think so, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do you think there was anything that you forgot that you had to think about after I'd had to remind you? Uh, well, you reminded me though, so that was, I mean, you told me what to do, so that was, yeah, I think okay. that was all right, yeah. All right. So, if we do it again, mm-hmm. and I prompt you on a few things, would you be happy to try and do it yourself? Yeah, I'll give it a go, yeah. With a couple of reminders if, yeah. if I can see that you've forgotten something? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. So tell me what your plan is now, head or all. All right. So what's my plan? So my plan is I'm going to let you perform it again. Now, this is where I fall down a little bit because I'm thinking, I'm not... Do I remind you about your, your blind spot again? Or do I keep stum until you make the mistake? Let's play those out both ways. If you let me make the mistake and then remind me, uh, or if you prompt me before I've done it, what, what do you gain from each? Well, if I... 
keep strong and let you make the mistake, then I'll know in my mind he's not quite getting this yet. Whereas if I prompt you before, then yes, you'll do your check, but I still won't know at the back of my mind whether you would do it if I wasn't here. How would, <laughs> how would you be able to tell that? Ah, I know what you're driving at. <laughs> a reminder. I need to remind you before we set off. But I can't remind you of all the little things that I'll be looking at throughout the whole thing, can I? Well, before what do you, we set what off. do you need to remind me of? Right, so would I say to you... I don't want to keep saying the word remember, but... Um, Remember's a great word. <laughs> oh, is it? I was a bit nervous about saying Remember that what time. we talked about, about observations. Where yeah. are you going to look? Yeah. So, where are you Far, going to look? All the way around. Okay. Bingo. So, do I need to say at every stage of Whatever the way? Whatever you do, don't give me a go at this on my own. I will mess it up. Right. Big time. Right. And I might even throw in the clutch control problem again. Oh, my God. And then if you ask me why that's happening, I'll say, oh, sorry, I just got confused. Right. So, I'm then all over the... <laughs> I keep turning it off. <laughs> So what should I do at this stage now then? So what does it say on your sheet? Well, it says prompt questions and answers. Mm -hmm. But I thought I'd Does it say so prompt questions and answers after he's made another mistake? No, so I've got to make sure you don't make the mistake. Don't allow the mistake to happen. Right. So you, you've prevented it by your talk through. You now need to remind me to do what you've just told me to do. Then you can say, have a go at that on your own. And if I get it right after that third thing, everything's okay. If you're running out of time and he's happy with what you've done, he, he might say to you, "Cause I've got me on." Mm. And then I'll have skipped this bit out. Yeah, but don't you don't you make that assumption? No, no, no. no, no. Honestly, it'll it'll he'll 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 whip you with it. No. <laughs> or she. <laughs> this is getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> I'll leave it that out. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just. Remind you this time, and then leave you to have a go at it. But so, but there's so many things throughout the whole thing to remind you of. What are the things I've got wrong? Well, there's the 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 steering, the um, clutch control. Oh, the well, clutch not, control well, you fixed. Yeah, the the, the 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 braking going down the camber. Shall we call it the camber? Camber, whatever you're Camber, right um, and the. Um, observations. Mm -hmm. So I can't, do I remind you throughout the whole thing? Right, okay. When are you going to do your reminding? Well, I can do it before and during. Is that when? But when the car stopped. So I can do it now? Mm -hmm. Right, okay. Yeah, but remind me about my observations first. Okay. All right then. So are we doing this as in setting off now? Or? Mm -hmm. okay. Well, the, I mean, there's lots of things to do here. But do do it now? Yeah. I would. So I'll say to you, no, you can remember what we've talked about with the observations. Do you want me to do a dual roll thing? Yeah. I'll show you. Okay. okay. Okay, Bob, what we're going to do is we're going to have another go this time. I've talked you through the last time, so we now know what we're expecting. Yeah. But it's probably a bit too much to expect you to remember all that all at once. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to remind you this time of the things that you need to do. And then we'll see how we get on. Happy with that? Yeah, that sounds okay. Okay, so get the car ready the way you would do. Just find the bite and hold the car still. Now remember what we said about observations? Oh yeah, yeah, Where are you going to look before the car moves? Oh, it's all around, isn't it? That's it. Brilliant. Well done. Now then, what do we, just before you move, what do we say about steering? Oh, it was big steering. Yeah, it was trying to get your hands to touch at the top and the bottom of the wheel, wasn't it? Okay, so just observations again. Look all around. Can you go? Oh no, I can't. What are you going to do then? I'll wait for these people to come past. Okay. Do you think it would be sensible to put the handbrake on again? Oh yeah, I think it probably would. So we'll wait for them to move out of the way. So, we need a fresh set of observations. Where are you going to look? Oh yeah, it was all the way around. And how much steering are you going to use here? Oh, lots, yeah. Big movements, you said. Touch your hands at the top and the bottom. That's it. Just bring it to a stop there. Okay. Can you remember what the observations we needed to take were at this point? Um, oh, it was up and down the road, wasn't it? That's right. Now this car's coming, what are you going to do about him? Uh, oh, he looks like he's going to wait. He's going to go in that way. So, before we move away here, remember we're going to run downhill here, so what do you need to do? Oh, it was a clutch down and use the brake, wasn't it? That's right. So just slow it down the way we thought about it. Now you need to steer the other way, don't you? So big movements with the steering, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Stop there. 
so we've got to this part. Yeah. Tell me about the observations you need to take before you move away again. Oh, it's all the way around. And where do you need to look before the car moves? Oh, it's through the back window. Okay, so that's good. So again, we get the halfway point. Get the rest of the steering on. Stop there. What observations do you need to take? Oh, it's all the way around, isn't it? Yeah. That's it. And before you move off again, which way are you going to be looking? Oh, backwards. That's right. Well done. Think about how much steering you're going to use. Oh, yeah, well, a lot, isn't it? Stop there. Right. Where do you need to be looking now? Oh, it's over this shoulder, isn't it? That's right. Now, how are you going to control the speed of the car on the way back here? Yeah? Oh, it's on the brake, isn't it? That's right. Well done. What do we need to do with the steering? Oh, yeah, it's all the way around, isn't it? Stop there. Okay. Tell me about the observations you're going to take before you move off. Oh, I'll check all the way around. Do you need to check your blind spots? Oh, I do, yeah, yeah. So really, this front... I'm an idiot. I can't do it without your help. This this part here is quite a massive key, isn't it? Can't I mean, they all are, but I've not really scrutinised this section. So the prompt is, what are we going to do now? Tell me what we're going to do. Remember yeah. what we said here? Oh, yeah. Tell me what that was. Yeah, so it's like, now remind, mm -hmm. but you're reminding them with a question. You can do. Yeah, well, but that works quite well, it, doesn't it? Does, it? it does, it does. It works well in here? my mind right. at this stage. Especially Just during some... us with questions. So whilst this can be the hardest thing, because there's a lot going go wrong, it can also be the easiest, because the time that you're going to be doing the question is where the car stood still. Mm. And sometimes when it's on the move, but mostly when it's stood still. So now I'll be saying, OK, Bob, that was very well done. Excellent. Very well done. Um, you seem to be getting the hang of this now. How would you feel about having to go with that on your own? Yeah, I think I could manage that. Right. And now you just sit in silence. Sit in silence. Zip. And if he gets it right, tick. Fantastic. Well done. Woo! <laughs> right. Does that make sense? It does. Okay. Well, let's let's take let's take you for a cup of tea and a debrief. Yeah. Well done. Anything? All right. <laughs> just the complexity of it all, and and actually, to me now, it's all it feels like there's that much. Mm. But I felt like this last time, mm. and then when I broke it all down after watching it back, okay. and thought, yeah, that makes sense, that makes sense. Okay. It's amazing how much you can learn from watching and, oh, gosh, and, yeah. and thinking. Yeah. And, and well, yeah, I mean, that's it. Once you're in reflective mode, that's when human beings learn the most. Yeah. I think, for me, what the, the biggest part of what I've taken home today is this part here, okay. this this the prompts and questions and answers after you full talk through. Well, what this process is all about is about stripping away all the periphery, mm. getting rid of all the nonsense that we don't really need mm. and just focus on the stuff that's really important. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cup of tea and a debrief. Yeah.